Hey guys, how are we? How are we? Let me go back through and say hi to everyone. Hi, double seven. Congrats on getting first. Hi, Whitney. Hi, Fearsome. Hi, Duck Duck. Hi, Blue Jay. Thank you for the lurk. Hi, Nana. Hi, Duck. Uh, yes, I said hi to Duck Duck. Already confused. Hi, Pine Crossing. Hi, Zinead. Hi, Ladybug. Hi, Inagle. How are we? Hi, Adelina. Hi, Virgo. Hi, Chris. How are we? Happy Friday. Happy Friday. Are we, is everybody excited for the weekend? And I do apologize to those whose Friday is not today. I know we have a couple people. But for those that it is your Friday, are you excited for Friday? Are we excited for the weekend? Do we have plans? Do we have plans? Let me know what our plans are for the weekend. And the Hydrate Wizard, thank you for the drink reminder. Yes. Um, you're having the Hawaiian Shaved Ice Lot today. Nice. Yeah, I'm... It's okay. Like, I'll drink it. Like, it's I'm, I don't drink it and go, ugh, I hate this. Um, but it's not one of my favorites, I would say. Yeah. No plans, just chill time. Guys, guys, guys. Invisicat bats her eyelashes innocently. Innocent. Mm-hmm. You're not. No, there's no innocence here, 007. But thank you for those. Um, you feel the same way about that, Alani? Yes. Yes. I mean, it's okay. It's like, if someone handed it to me, I would drink it. No problem. Um, but if I had a choice, I would not choose it. If, if that makes sense. Uh, it's not inherently a bad drink. It's just... If I have other flavors, I'm going to go for the other flavors first. Or uh, it's one that I'll drink if I want to break from, like, my normal core group of flavors. So, yes. Um, but after Monday, you're off for two weeks and you go to Athens. Nice, nice. Uh, feel free to take pictures and post them in the Discord. Uh, we do have a section where you can just post regular pictures. Um, it is separate from the selfie channel. So, feel free to post pictures and stuff. Like, I, I love seeing stuff like that. So, yes. Also, if you come across funny videos or memes, feel free to share those. Uh, your boyfriend is home. He's a trucker, so you get to spend time with him. Nice. And hi, Catherine. Welcome on in. And hi, Pure Siren. Thank you for the lurk, Kirsty. Uh, pool party today. Pedicures with Bestie tomorrow. Can't remember for Sunday. Okay, so I think, I, th I think Fearsome has the best weekend so far. Mm hmm I was just informed today that I'm going to be woken up super early tomorrow. Not, not thrilled. When I said how early, crack of dawn, what does that mean? 6 a.m. Absolutely not. Absolutely not. No. But they are supposedly finishing my fins tomorrow, which is good because... Told the mod sis I'm not thrilled. Someone bought the house right behind my house and they've moved in and I'm mad. Now I have to actually like remember to close blinds at night. I'm mad about this. I'm grumpy. <laughs> right? I mean, how dare someone buy a house? Uh, I'm more mad about the fact that I can't like, I, I have to now remember... To close it. Frost, there's still one house that's open. Uh, the only problem is the back door opens up directly to, in, like, facing my shed. And that's not a good view. So. Yeah. And hi, Purple. How are you? Although, like, Frost, you, you could still buy it. You could. I mean, you technically could. Here, I'm, I'm gonna send you what they're what they're selling for. You may be able to afford that. I don't know if it's like different, like if it's like that's within budget or not. Um, because I I don't know the difference in like cost of living from where you are to where I am. So, right, Frost. Ask him if you can work remote. See how they say, respond to that. That would be hilarious. That would be hilarious. Um, you get to wake up at 7 a.m. both days this weekend, Native Angel? Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. 
That's the, yeah. You always wake up early on 7 a.m. on your days off. You love mornings. I am not a morning person, y'all. Absolutely not a morning person. As you can see, I start stream midday and I'm even late to that. So, the days that I have to start stream at like 10 a.m. because it's a specialty stream, yeah, they definitely not. Definitely not. Would not work. Would not work. It, it doesn't work. Yeah, hardly ever. Let me dream, Frost. Let me dream. And I, Christine, how are you? Uh, light wakes you up to the crack of dawn right now. It's 4.50 a.m. Oh, duck, duck. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I am a afternoon, early evening type person. I am an afternoon, early evening. Yeah. Mm-hmm. My perfect wake up time is like 9.30, 10 a.m. Sometimes a little bit later. Just depends. And then like I start getting tired. Somewhere it's it varies. So I get tired between like 10.30 at night and like 3 a.m. So somewhere in there is when I go to bed. I, I do not have a consistent schedule. I should, but I just, I can't. It doesn't work like that for me. You're off work today. Nice, nice. Uh, you're moving to where you won't have a neighbor for miles, so you're pretty stoked. Yeah, so Linica, so basically the reason why I'm, I'm grumpy about this is when I bought my house, there was a huge field behind the house. And that was the selling point for the house because I wanted privacy, but I didn't want, I wanted to be in a neighborhood, but I also wanted privacy. So I was looking at houses that backed up to woods mostly. And then this popped up and now it's like a huge reason why I bought my house is gone. I never wanted to back up to someone's house if I didn't know who they were ahead of time. Like never wanted that. Um, so now I'm having to back up to someone's house and I'm not thrilled. So, yeah. And then there's you waking up at 7.30 for work Monday through Friday. So, I, you know, I used to have to wake up at, at 5.30 for work. It was not fun. It was not fun. Because I had a half hour drive. And it takes me about an hour to hour and a half to get ready. That's if I eat. If I don't eat, it's usually about like 45 minutes or so. Um, but yeah, I used to have to get up at 5.30 and I hated it. I hated it so much. Mm-mm. Yeah, then then there was a there was a time to where um, work for me started at seven, and I was like, absolutely not. I didn't last long on that shift. <laughs> part of that was like, I didn't like the hours, but then the other part of it was the boss forced me to go to nights because I had lowest seniority. So, and then I found I did, I really loved the people on night shift. I just didn't really care for the like being awake all night part. So, yes. Uh, your weekend includes pool, reading, drinking, hammock laying, and sleeping. Nice, nice. Catherine, that sounds like a wonderful weekend. A wonderful weekend. Uh, you bought one of those pools from Walmart. So you're going to set it up this weekend. Tomorrow your dogs have to go to the vet. Vet visits are not fun. Apollo is very adamant against vet visits. Um, now whenever he sees the ramp to go up into my mom's car, he runs. It's hilarious. Absolutely hilarious. Uh, you're a night owl. Okay, can, uh, mods, can we do a poll if you are a morning person, a midday person, or a night owl? I kind of want to know, like, where we all land with this. You wake up at 4 for work, Crystal? No. It's same with Lydia. No, I, I couldn't. I couldn't. No. Um, thank God you work from home, otherwise you have to spend 80 minutes coming and going from work every day. Nope. I could not do that. Uh, he runs away from the ramp. He runs away from the ramp, yeah. I used to wake up at 6 for school. Yeah, I had to wake up at 6 because I was one of the first bus stops. It was... 6.50 was when they would be at, at my bus stop. Yeah. 650 it was not fun not fun not fun at all are uh, you work in a different time zone so you don't have to work until noon Whitney that's kind of cool though that's kind of cool uh, you can basically go to work anytime between 5 30 and 9 at, and you go after 5 30 because you want to get home early yeah so like I loved flexible schedules like that to where you could go in at any time 
and you would just finish when you were done. Like, I loved that. Because I, I did have a schedule like that once, and it was amazing, and I got so much done. Didn't last long, because then we changed managers, and the manager decided that that wasn't efficient enough. Because everyone wanted to come in early and leave early, so... <laughs> they took it away. I was sad. I was very sad. Um, you used to be a night owl, though. Now it depends on the day. No, that is actually, that is actually very, uh, normal. I used to be a solid night owl, and then I worked night shift, and that kind of moved me to an afternoon person. I've never been a morning person. And if mom was here, she would tell you. She would 100% tell you. Uh, you don't have school, you don't have buses for school? Yeah. Bus, the school bus was a formative experience for any U.S. kid. Every U.S. kid has a story of something that happened on the bus. Yeah. Yeah, the... School buses are, 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 are definite proving ground when you are growing up. You either keep your head down and you watch something happen to everything, watch things happen to other people. You either take part in it or you're the butt of the jokes of the bus. So, yeah. School buses are rough. School buses are rough. A school bus sounds so exotic. They can be. They can be. Now, when you're on the school bus going to, like, a big field trip or something on the uh, rare occasion you got to go on a field trip, um, then it was fun. Then they were, then it was really fun. But apart from that, nah. Uh, grade three to five, your mom was your bus driver? Oh, Catherine, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Uh, yeah. I think we can all agree that, like, growing up was rough. Growing up was rough. To some degree. Um, and as well, yeah, so I made my mom drive my... I didn't have my license, so I couldn't drive my senior year. Uh, so I made my mom drive me to school every day. I did not step on the bus once. Uh, you had to walk to school, but your mom was a school bus driver. That's kind of... Yeah, I did, I did walk to school in middle school. Yeah. All right, so it looks like we are mostly midday and night owls. Okay. And there's three people that are morning people. That's fair. That's fair. And hi, gaming. How are you? Um, you just have regular... Oh, like the regular uh, public transportation buses. Yes. Yes. My stepdad actually worked on those. In our, like, in our general area. Yeah. He worked on those for the majority of his life and pretty much, like, did, like, the engines part of it so he is like really really good with cars and like small engines and such yeah i think like right now he just take he recently took apart one of those big riding lawnmowers and fixed it for someone yeah just just because he could I'm like okay you do you uh your mom joined school and walked to you in your first class all the way up to freshman year really i wouldn't let her i wouldn't let my mom do that no, drop off and run. Drop off and run. And hey, Breezy, welcome on in. Welcome on in. And, um, yes, guys, make sure you say a very, very, very happy birthday to Breezy. It is their birthday today. Oh, your primary school is 10 minutes away from your house, so you walked every day? Yeah. Yeah, I, I, I lived right... It was like a street away from railroad tracks that divided the school from like everywhere else. So I just walked. Um, yes, it's freshman, which is your ninth grade year. Sophomore, which is your 10th grade year. Junior is your 11th. And senior is your 12th grade year. So that is your four years of high school. For those not in the U.S. I just thought about that. So, yes. Um, it goes, you have preschool and kindergarten. And then you go from kindergarten, you're usually like five or six. Um, and then it goes first grade, second grade, third grade, fourth grade, fifth grade. Um, 
and that's elementary school. And then you have sixth grade, seventh grade, and eighth grade, which is your typical middle school. Or I guess it would be secondary school is another way that people would have called it. Um, some middle schools started bringing fifth grade into it. I don't know. There's kind of like, there's kind of a big mental shift that you go through as a kid when you leave the elementary school and you get to go to the big kid middle school. Yeah. And then you go to high school and you're like, send me back. Drop off and run is more of a tuck and roll. They needed gym mats out. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, some parents were like that. Some parents were like that. It was like a, I'm not stopping. Get out and go. I will slow down to five miles an hour. If you don't get out, you're getting dragged. Not in actuality, but that was what the parents would always threaten you with. Uh, th those, those are the, the interesting days. Um, uh, you moved between fifth and sixth, so you graduated fifth and went back to an elementary and graduated sixth. Really? Yes, so middle school is also called junior high. Mm hmm So for for our non-US friends, I we must be confusing you so much. I I'm sorry. Um uh, different school districts. Yeah, different school districts and even like within the same state, like different school districts within the um same city. Cuz uh in a city you can have multiple schools that you can go to. And the really weird thing is you can cross the street in your neighborhood and be in a different school district. Yes. And hi, Munchkin. How are you? It's a very interesting, interesting setup. Uh, you had kindergarten through sixth grade, then middle school was seventh through eighth grade, and then high school was ninth through twelfth. Yeah, and then like some private schools will go like uh, preschool through eighth grade. So, yeah, just different schools, different rules, different areas you live in. And I'm doing good, Munchkin. I'm doing good. All right, we do need to do flavor of the day. I'm getting distracted. And we haven't done flavor of the day yet. Uh, K through fifth, you're on a special track and had shorter summers but longer winter holidays. Yeah, and then like some schools will have like different like school calendars and such. It's so weird. It is so weird. Yes, and if they built a new school, the district changed, and nobody can remember who was. Who went to what school? Yeah, yeah. Those are the days. But all right, let us do flavor of the day. And where is my thingy? Where is my thingy? Ah, here we go. All right. Ooh. All right. 79% of you said blue. And 21% said pink. So, get your sips in chat. I'm really interested by this. All right. So, the flavor of the day for today is... Dun, dun, dun! It's blue. It's breezeberry. It is Breezeberry. So, congrats to anybody that chose blue. All right. Oh, I'm sorry, Elena. It was blue. It was blue. So, looks like Whitney has gambled the most and got the most back. So Whitney gambled 8,000, got back 10,102. That's really cool. That's really good. So round of applause for Whitney being our top gambler. Round of applause. All right. All right. Okie doke. So. Hundred baby. We also we're we're gonna do bingo in just a sec, but a hundred baby guys. If you will believe it, 
we are very, very, very close to finishing this. So, with that being said, if uh, someone wants to do exclamation point next in chat, I think that'll work. Yeah, if someone wants to do exclamation point next, because I know there has been some questions on it. Yep. Thank you, 007. Um, so, yes. So, um, well, so while we're close to the end of the Extreme Edition of the 100 Baby Challenge, um, that is, I am confirming that that is what we are going to be doing. I decided, yes, I am going to take two months off of the 100 Baby Challenge to focus on our other challenges, get a little bit further in, um, the elemental and get back into the not so berry and kind of like try to get those a little bit more finished out. Um, but then we are going to start doing a few more building. We'll start with build streams like we did with this challenge and we'll be doing a countryside spellcaster edition. So we'll have, um, farm animals. They'll be living on a farm. Um, they'll make money through selling their produce basically. Yeah. So they'll, they'll make money by selling their produce. Um, but yes, it's, it's going to be a lot of fun. We will spend most of our time in Hinford on Bagley. Um, uh, and we're going to bounce around between the big lots. So yeah, we'll bounce around from one big lot to the next. Um, I am going to use mods for it. So we will turn aging on. So the, the, um, matriarch will still age while she's pregnant. And, um, if there's any other fun mods you want me to try out, we can use it. To, we can do it during that time. So, yes. And thank you for the lurk, hippie. Thank you. As long as no chickens get yeeted. I will do my best not to yeet any chickens. I will do my best not to yeet any chickens. Mm-hmm. Yes. So, it'll, it'll be a lot of fun. And Sin, not to worry, not to worry. Adelina is still a young adult. Still a young adult. Um, yes, we can use Wonderful Whims. If you have a mod, uh, a request of a mod that you'd like me to consider using for it, go ahead and drop it in the Discord in the um, CC recommendations under Sims Chat. So go ahead and drop it in there and I will take a look at it. And yeah. Yeah, I, th I think that I think that's all I think that's all I had for that. Yeah, th for the moment. So basically, we're gonna we'll focus on elemental and not so berry uh, because we are. Did I call her Adelina? No, it's because Sin said Adelina. Sin, Sin said Adelina. Yeah, Sin said Adelina. So I just read that. Uh, Jake's died from hysteria day. Jake's matriarch. I, I, guys, I don't think it's possible for us to die from hysteria. I'm just saying. Because... Yeah, we we don't... Like, we've tried killing them from hysteria. It doesn't work. It doesn't work. I don't... So, I, Jake also has a lot of broken mods. So... <laughs> He very rarely updates his mods. That's why a lot of things go wrong in his game. Because he does not update his mods like he should. I, I can't tell you how many times we've told him to update his mods. That's the number one thing when you do use mods though. Um, so yeah, so once, you, once I decide what mods um, we will use for it, then I will update the um, CC list. So that is a master list of all of the mods and CC that I currently have in my game. As um, So that way if you guys would like to see, like download certain things. Um, I have not filled out the build by or the cast CC list yet. Um, but this will tell you what all of my basic mods and other mods are. So yeah. A sin, no, I've called her Adelina. I've called Ariana Adelina I don't know how many times. I don't know how many times. 
Um, yeah, so guys, like, PSA, update your mods. Update your mods. That is, like, the biggest thing that you can do when playing the game. Is make sure your mods stay updated. Yeah. So, I know there's a bunch of mods that, um... A bunch of mods that are out for babies and such. So, definitely, if there's a mod you want me to look into, go ahead and drop it in the CC recommendations. And, yeah, I'll take a look at them. Update self. Yes, and up and make sure your Twitch mods update themselves, too. You used to never update mods until they broke. Now you're constantly doing it. Yeah, Always, always, always update that. Um, I do have a section in the Discord that will tell you um, if m certain mods have been updated. So you can always check that out as well. So, all right, let's hop into Bingo and then we'll hop into Sims. Uh, but yeah, I just wanted to do that PSA of like, this is the plan. We're going to, we'll continue after I take a break from toddlers. I need a break. I just, because I need a break from toddlers, guys. Desperately need a little bit of a break. You already updated yourself. Okay, good, Frost. Uh, your broke sims just had twins. One time you don't try. Yeah, twins, I found if you don't try for them, you get them. And if you try for them, you don't get them. So. But all right. Oh, slash, if you are ready for bingo, if you have not grabbed your bingo card. That is how you grab your bingo cards. You'll hover over the screen right over that way. It'll thing, it'll be a thing that pops up that says live bingo. You click that. You click grab free card. You can get additional cards for 200 biddies a piece up to six additional cards. And if you are on mobile, it'll be at the top right of your chat. Um, You just scarf some nachos and, of course, a Swiss roll because you have no self-control when little Debbie cakes are in your pantry. That is fair. I think I... I still have one Dunkaroo left, and I'm not letting myself eat it. Um, there was one time we got triplets, and it was so unexpected. Uh, Hydrate Wizard, we got triplets twice in the very first set when we just got started with this, and it was a nightmare. Absolute nightmare. Um, and yes, guys, I will up it to where we get, we have, um, I will use, we will use the twins and such traits for, um, like the for the lot traits and such. So yeah, and no sin. We don't want fussy. We don't want fussy. Have I tried putting Swiss rolls in the freezer? Really? Okay, that's kind of interesting. But all right, let's go ahead and get started with bingo. A Sims three modding is a whole other kettle of fish. Okay. That's, yeah, that's fair. That's fair. That's fair. All right, Breezy, you are the chosen one. Good luck. Good luck. Uh, the extreme version of this challenge is we have to have all 100 babies with one matriarch. Every 25 kids we pick up and move to a brand new house, reset our funds to zero, and we have to find a new way to make money. And the dads are subjected to a coin flip to determine if they live or if they are sent to Vlad. And Vlad has a tendency to use them as test subjects. Um, and his test subjects typically never survive. So, yeah. I don't have to want fussy. You want them for me? Mm-hmm. Oh, and also, once we choose a method of making money, we can't reuse that in a later set. So, yeah, basically, we explored a multitude of different ways of making money. Yep. It's been fun, though. It has definitely been fun. Stressful, but fun. Stressful, but fun. All right. Our first Pokemon of the day is... Abra. Pinsir. Psyduck. Articuno. Zubat. Farfetch'd, Porygon, Poliwag, Drowsy, Venusaur, Ammonite or Wyatt, Dragonite, 
Starmie. Blastoise. Gyarados. Ditto. Hitmonchan. Slowpoke. Flareon. Arbok. I was going to say, it's kind of hating on the bees today. Vileplume. Ponyta or Emma. Vulpix. Raichu. Charizard. Gengar. Charmander. Pikachu! Ivysaur. Oh, we got a bingo! Oh, Breezy, I am so sorry. I see that. Oh, oh, rips for Breezy. Breezy needed one of the few not called in B. Alright guys, you know the rules. If you were one away, put a root in chat. If you were two or more away, put a ban or a bop in chat. Ooh. Oh, oh. Frost, how far away were you this time? You got one recently. Even though we had to peer pressure you into doing it. Two away in two places. That's fair. That's fair. All right. Well, Whitney, it looks like you are the only one. So big congrats to Whitney. All right. There we go. Now let's take a look at the leaderboard. Whitney, that has skyrocketed you to number one for the month at 41 points. Evelina, Native Angel are tied for second with 22 points. And Mel Spells uh, coming in fourth with 13 points. Now. Ooh. Whitney, this has also bumped you up to fifth overall. And you're sitting at a nice 114 points. So, yes. At Frost Bands Bingo every day. Every day we play Frost Bands Bingo. I'm kind of used to it at this point. So, all right. All right. Well, thank you, guys. Thank you for playing bingo with us. Are we ready to hop into some Sims? Yep, see, she admits it. She admits it. Mm -hmm. All right. Are we ready to hop into Sims? Oh, slash if you're ready to hop into Sims. You won one last month and then nothing so far this month. Frost, it's only day three of the month. It's only day three, I promise. There's time. There's time. All right. Well, let me, let's take a quick inventory. We have Elsa, who is a B student. So Elsa will probably be, yeah, Elsa will be aged out by tomorrow. Wait, where is your homework? All right, so we're going on a quick homework hunt. Oh, where is the homework? There's the homework. We found the homework. All right, come do your homework. You can play video games later. Adrian obviously needs to pee and has done homework. Okay. Is this your project? Yes, that is Adrian's project. And then we have Melody. Who just needs a bit of thinking and movement. All right. Uh, teach shapes to Melody, and then you can teach to Stack. And then we have Rufus, who's hungry. Yeah, eat the asado, because you're hungry. And Rufus needs pretty much everything. All right. 
All right, what what is Frost doing? Um, Bands in chat if you haven't won bingo in a long time. Uh, yeah, you guys can also do bops. You can also do bops if you don't have a ban. Frost is ban is like full on banning bingo. All right, Frost. All right. All right. Who's at my mailbox? Oh, it's Phineas. Hi, Phineas. Yeah, let's find Chip. Alrighty. I think the only skill we can really try to get up for her is the um, video gaming skill. But I'm not really even all that concerned about it. Do we have food? We have one left. All right, you can grill the asado. Then I'm going to have her do her shapes on her own. Then we'll just have someone help her stack, and then boom, she ages up and we good. Wait, did nobody... Oh, did I had them take a vacation day today. That's right. That's right. What are we doing for money now? Um, we are writing books. So we've got 120... A thousand simoleons. Our um, future hubby has has uh, nine hundred thousand simoleons. So we're gonna be retiring her and five kids with a million simoleons. Yep. All right. Oh, did you finish your homework? You did. Okay, good. Do your extra credit work. Fine, I'll make you do it outside. You don't technically need to do it, but I'm going to make you do it anyway. Did you really... You really did. She really came in here just to do this. And hi, Essie. Welcome on in. Oh, you're playing Not So Very and you gave your orange gen her adult makeover? Nice. Our orange gen is a boy. Yeah, our, our, our orange gen is a boy. Why did you put that down just to pick it back up? That makes no sense. That makes zero sense. Yeah, go go potty and then go slide. Why are you crying, child? Why are you crying? Guys, guys, guys. Double seven. Something under Bella's pillow. Thank you for those. Uh, no, I don't want a job. I do not want a job. Thank you, though. Alright, as soon as you're done with you, with that... There we go. Perfect. Your extra credit is done. Alright, start working carefully. All right. Yes, and she's tired. So, okay. I don't know if Melody is going to age up in time. Because she needs to sleep. Like, desperately sleep. Hmm. All right, then. Uh, potty help. Wait, who said you could sleep? I did not say you could sleep. I didn't say you could sleep. Bellabot, read the room. Now is not the time. Uh, 
not see she's not really getting movement up that fast all right good adrian finished the school project wonderful adrian what do you need ah you need food but that's fine all right put it in here put it in the inventory then you can go eat and, uh, Sasu, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch here, and get comfy. Alright, she's going good. You're fine, Elsa. Oh! Elsa's doing the potty training. Ooh! Okay, okay, so if Elsa's doing the potty training... That means that you can do, you can do shapes. <gasps> I love having a, t a teen in the house sometimes. I love having a teen. I forgot that, th I forgot about that for a second. I've done the 100 baby challenge. How many times did I keep forgetting that that's an option? Wow. Wow. All right. Well, maybe this will get your skill up. All right. So that's not going to. Uh, come here and babble then. Let's get this skill up. Quiet thinking skill. Great. Yeah, that, that's wonderful. That's wonderful, toddlers. All right. Oh, we might be able to. Come on, you can do it. I just got to age you up by 10 o'clock. I have a cake, right? I do. Okay, baby can baby can scream for a bit. Okay, communication level 3, wonderful, wonderful. I will let you sleep. Absolutely not. Go play dolls. <sighs> Alright, we are going to figure out a way to do this, guys. Perfect. No. Alright. Come on. Come on. No more of that. We have to do movement. We have to do movement. No, Moana. That's actually kind of terrifying that you had a baby. Just a little bit. She's one of the few kids. Moana and Miss Piggy and Milo, I think, are the ones that I hope that I had hoped would not reproduce. So. Yeah. Yeah, they're the ones that I would have hoped would not have reproduced. So, yeah. All right. Almost there. Almost there. I know she's exhausted, but it's fine. It's fine. Ha ha ha! No movement. Okay. No, you don't know. <sighs> All right, y'all, you got a toddler down. That's frustrating. Candle self from mom. Wake up and blow your candles out. Not us cutting it close to the very last possible second. Alright, wake up. No, you don't get to play. No, wake up. Okay, come on. We got just by 10. I, we're so close. 
We're so close. All right, add birthday candles. All right, come on, please. Please have aged up in time. Why are you not aging up? Okay, that was so stressful. All right, guys. So, it's because she's fussy because of y'all. Really? I, uh... All right, let's see. Three. A motor child who is... Yeah, okay. Who is mean. Do we like mean for Melody? This is Ariel's daughter. Do we like mean for her? If we like mean for her, then I will go ahead and lock it in in five, four, three, two, one, zero. All right. Y'all are making her mean. All right, please tell me she can go to school in the morning. She can. Oh, thank goodness. Or, fine, eat that. And hi, Jack Hiss, how are you? How is your day going? All right. Did you just take it? Sit. I know you're hungry. Sit, please. Yeah, because then you got to sleep. That's a lot of gifts, though. That is a lot of gifts. How are you doing on your project out here? Change your outfit into your cold weather. Cold, change into your cold weather. All right. Work carefully. Thank you. Don't freeze, please. That'd be bad. And welcome on, and welcome on in from TikTok. Welcome on in. Um, and yes, we want to do tiara time. All right. Hi, Kenzie. Hi, Kenzie. Um, I just updated Melody's trait. They made her mean. Um, but welcome in. And yes, thank you, Hydra Wizard. So this is actually the third time we've done it. Which is wild. Third time. Yep. It's definitely been interesting. Definitely been interesting. Alright, uh, cause I don't want you to die. Eat some asado, please. And then you can d go do what you want. I kinda want you to, to wake up and eat. Yeah, I kinda want you to eat. Yeah, every, everybody just, like, make yourself presentable for school, please. I'm not asking for much. Alright, finish that up, please. If you could do dishes, that'd be wonderful. Yeah. Wait, what is your skill? It was fitness. Okay. Fitness. All right. Okay. Not, not too bad. 
Is there a reason you're waking these children up? Oh, if you're gonna do that, go cry in the mirror. Go cry in the mirror. Give yourself a, give yourself a pep talk in the mirror instead of crying in bed. Please and thank you. Are you having fun with this or are you not having fun with this? I never remember if... So some, some sims have fun with chess, some sims don't. Not nearly as much as you should. All right. Okay, well, you're logic level two. We already have a fitness level three, so play, play video games. Something to get your fun up. Please. All right, there we go. Perfect, there we go. Yes, I know you're tired. Everyone's tired in this household. Everyone's tired. Everyone's hungry. Everyone's a mess. That's just part of this challenge. If you aren't tired and hungry, you are not one of my kids. Sad to say, that is the truth. All right, there we go. Thank you for the pasta check, Essie. Yes, guys, if you have not recently, make sure you are checking your posture, popping your back, popping your neck, stretching out if you need to. Alternatively, if you would prefer, you can always go into the kitchen and check on your pasta to make sure it is there and it is not lonely. All right. And we got a screaming baby. Of course we do. All right, take care of the baby. Thank you. Why are you sad still? Oh, okay. That's fine. As long as it goes away, I'm happy. No. You can go clean that, please. Thank you. Where are you going? Meet new sibling. Oh, okay. And, uh, Mama Momo, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, and get comfy. Let's see, are you going to be happy or mad that you have a new sibling? He's mad about it. All right. I mean, there's nothing you can do, child. Not a single thing. All right, as soon as you're done with that, potty help. Well, all right then. You got your skill to level two. I need you to do homework first, though. Yeah, because you're almost go you're almost ready to go to school. Clean that up and then do your extra credit work. That is not cleaning up. Oh my gosh. Okay, so, I believe I said it was Shigo that is not getting moved out. No. Hold on. Rufus, I think, is the last. Melody and Rufus, I think, are the ones that may or may not get moved out. No, Rufus is the one that will not be moved out in order to make room until the very, very end. So I, I believe, yeah. Yep. Ru Rufus may or may not get moved out. So this guy right here may be with us until the very end. All right, study hard and study hard. Child, go to school. Thank you. 
All right, everyone's off to school. What do you need, child? Don't help. Is she asleep again? Why is she asleep again? No sleepy for you. Thank you. Ban math. Yes, ban math. Because math is is hard. Especially when you're trying to do like Sims math. To where you're trying to figure out how many kids are in like how many spaces in a household. That's complicated. That is very complicated. We don't acknowledge math in this house? Yes, that is fair. That is fair. All right. Ooh, it's Chucky. Yeah, we'll talk to Chucky. We'll talk to our eldest. All right, Rufus reached level two. Great. Great, Rufus. Great. Wonderful. Now, because you unlocked that, you get to go potty until you fall asleep. Aren't I nice? Aren't I nice? Oh, no, not my dear math. Math is banned. Math is banned. Uh, math is hard when you don't have fingers. Only chickens do, and they are tasty. Duck, duck. Oh my goodness. Um. I'm just gonna go with sick. Thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, share, and get comfy. Y'all, I can't with y'all. All right. Okay, Chucky, I'm going to need you to hurry up and, and spill the tea because I have a crying thing I need to get rid of. Milo. Oh, God, Milo. What did Milo do now? The fact that Chucky knows Milo has me concerned. Yeah, has me concerned. All right. Oh, I was going to say, no, we're not interested in making a donation to charity. Thank you, though, but not interested. Yeah, I wasn't sure what to call the baby in the moment because it was annoying me. And I couldn't come up with anything witty, so I just said thing. Yeah. Pretty much. Thank you, Saribot. Always tell your bot that it's a good bot. All right, fin finish away. Now you can eat. All right, fingers crossed we might be eating a child. We might be. Why do I feel like there's something broke here? It's almost... We're overdue for a breakage. Yep, we're overdue for a breakage. Especially because, like, the only thing upgraded in this house is the beds. There it is. Told you we were overdue for a breakage. Do I know my stuff or what? All right. Come on, Tot. Are you at level three yet? Oh, you're getting close, though. Kind of. 
Kind of. Just go potty until you're done. Thank you. Bye. All right. Oh, we got two A's. Perfect. We're yeeting one and we're getting a teenager. All right. Teenager, teenager, come here. Let me sell your stuff. Sell that and can blow your candles out. Uh, you can shower at your new home. Am I psychic? No. I just know that you... Typically, when you have a 100-baby household, unless you've upgraded everything, something is always broken. It's just the laws of 100-baby. All right. Add birthday candles when you're done. All right. So this is for Elsa, guys. This is for Elsa. All right. So she is an oblivious, cheerful sim who is also... A maker. Yes, and someone is always stinky. It's usually a toddler. Usually a toddler because I do not allow my toddlers to get a bath. They have to earn a bath. Whether through my negligence or they've done really well and they deserve a bath because I have an extra teen. So, or they steal one. Yes, or they steal one. All right, do we like maker? If we like maker for her, then I will go ahead and lock it in in five, four, three, two, one, zero. All right, we will go with maker. All right, add birthday candles. Yes, thank you. Now you have to come blow your candles out. I mean, if if you're going to be like that... If you're going to be like that, you can mop. I'm going to put you to work before I let you leave my household. Alright, Adrian... Blow your candles out. And you are a squeamish child who is also a recycled disciple. Interesting. All right. Ooh, deviance though. A villainous valentine. They want to destroy the love lives of all sims, including their own. That's interesting. All right, guys. So, do we like Recycle Disciple? If we like Recycle Disciple, then I will go ahead and lock it in in five, four, Three, two, one. Okay, Talia, lactose intolerant. If we like lactose intolerant, then I will go ahead and lock it in in five, four, three, two, one, zero. All right, guys, you have to redeem. In order to change it, we have to redeem the um, re-roll, which is in the channel point section. Yes. Um, and Shay Campbell, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, share, and get comfy. So, yes, if no one wants to spend channel points for it, then we do lock it in. But Native Angel, genius. All right. Do we like genius? If we like genius, then I will go ahead and lock it in in five, four, three, two, one. Nope. Shalia again. Okay. Mean. All right. I guess the game likes mean today. 
But if we like mean, then I will go ahead and lock it in in five, four, three, two, one, zero. All right, we will lock in mean. Very interesting. Very interesting. It's not the co trait combination that I personally would have chosen, but it's, it's going to be interesting. Um, and that bags, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, share, and get comfy. I mean, it. it is going to be interesting. All right, Elsa, you're getting kicked out. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You cleaned for me. Thank you for that. Um, but it's time to go. You're moving in with Milo. All right. All right, so he is doing this. You know what? We're going to kick him out again. We're going to kick him out quick, too. One, two, three, four, five, six. All right, Rufus. You got this, my dude. You got this. This might be your last potty, actually. Ooh, is it your last potty? Is it? Yes, it was. Fantastic. All right. Actually, Melody, you don't get to eat that. That's for the toddler. You're going to eat a ham and cheese sandwich instead. Put it down. Put it down. The toddler needs that more than you. Put, the, put, it, put it down. Put it down. Put it down. The food is going to be three quarters gone by the time you're done. No, because now the toddler's going to do this. Toddler, go here. You're going to put that down. Eat the asado. The toddler is now going to eat that. Yeah, so come eat this sandwich. <sighs> Children, why you so why you make my life so difficult? Make some chimmy, please. I don't get why. The, there we go. Oh, whoa, four. I look away for a second and you get to level four. All right, kid, all right. Proceed to eat. I know, I tell them don't eat, don't eat, and they eat anyway. Um, and Wiz Gamer, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, share, and get comfy. All right, go eat all this stuff. Eat your stuff. Do your homework, do a project, and I'm kicking you out. Bye. All right. Wait, wash your hands. Wash your hands. You nasty. Thank you for the lurk, Bandit. Like, who doesn't wash their hands? Who doesn't wash their hands after they pee? Like, that's gross. Please do not do. Please, please, please wash your hands. Cleanliness and all of that. Like, that's, that's kind of important. Sadly, too many people. Yes. 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 Mm -hmm. You don't wash your hands, but you wash your wings. But you wash up afterwards. That's the whole point. Is do you wash up afterwards? No. Put the baby down. 
Put put the baby down. You can't put the child in bed. You can't do that. I'm putting them to sleep. Go clean that, then you can go to bed. Oh, and, and you need to eat. Okay, just... Ariana, you're getting on my last nerve. You are getting on my last nerve. Eat and go to sleep. Get out of my hair. Go, Sue. Bye. Go, Shoe. Bye. We don't want you here. Okay, I got another project for the teenager. And we're going to have this project for the kiddo. Okay, there we go. Uh, your last job legit knew someone who would drop a deuce and walk out. Oh! No. No, that's, that's, that's crossing the line. No, absolutely not. Absolutely not. Nope. Nope. I would be calling HR on that person. I would 100% be calling HR on that person. Yep. No, that's, that's, that's pass. That's a, that's a hard pass. Yep. That's a, that's a hard pass. Nope. All right, kiddos. Everybody's going to bed. I've decided everybody's going to bed. We'll wake them all up in the morning. See, she did her homework. That's great. She's not even a B student. So it is what it is. When you wake up, you can go work on your skill. You can, I don't know what you can do when you wake up. Maybe I'll let you shower. Maybe. Yeah, a hundred percent. I would be. I would be calling HR on that person for literally everything. Did you eat? Did, uh, did you Did you sleep? Yes, you did. All right, go go do all that, and then I'm gonna send you out here to play chess until you go to school. Um, there's custodian call with clean toilet. Oh, no. This is why the guy on TikTok that he says that you can't eat at everybody's house. Cliff Alfasi. Who is Cliff? Probably a grandkid. Probably a grandkid. Mm-mm. Nope. Are you eating again? I realize you're pregnant, but like, dang. All right, we'll eat. We have movement and thinking. Hmm. I mean, yeah, when you wake up, grab a serving of food and then go potty. By that time, then hopefully mom can teach you something. Yeah, maybe, maybe by that time. Or not, we're waking, we're going to have to wake the kid up on our own. Should I have him do a project? I don't think he actually needs one. Melody's the one that needs the project, but she can't start it until she gets to level three, level four anyway. Again, another one. Stephen Hawthorne. Who is that? I hate when I get back to back deaths for no reason. I don't know who either of those were. Uh, but yeah, you can't eat at everyone's house. Also, why you don't eat anything in a potluck that you didn't bring or isn't store brought. That is true. That is true. That is true. There's certain people that you know don't eat. Don't. Just don't. I forgot we had a plant back here. Harvest all... And tend the garden. I forgot we had a plant back here. 
I full on forgot. That's my bad. I wonder if I play an online game with people. If I can. Yeah, I wonder if I play an online game with like my kids. I can play with Jack Sparrow nice, but you know what? We're going to go with Chucky and where's Cole? There's Cole. All right, we're going to play with Chucky and Cole, I think, because the, the toddler's too young to play. Yeah, we're going to do that. Um, we'll see if that gets her social need up. And I forgot it's a holiday, so we're... Number one, we got to play a quick game of Where's the Gnome? So I found one. No gnomes in the kitchen. A naked gnome in the toddler room. Nothing in the baby room. Anything in mom's room? No. Nothing in mom's bathroom. Nothing in the hall bathroom. All right. I think mom. I think that this floor we've we've combed. Next floor. Anything in this room? No. Anything in this room? No. No. Nothing in the bathroom. What about in mom's office? No. Nothing in where the angelfish are. All right. Don't you usually get three? Ah, there it is. There's the third one. There you go. All right. So we did find all three. I'm curious to see where they go. Yes. I'm curious to see where they go. All right. So we're going to have to watch them like a hawk to make sure they go to school on time. Is this getting our social up at all? No, it wasn't. And she's now upset. Well, poo. Ooh. Okay. Okay. Time to go to school. Time to go to school. Go to school and go to school. You can go to school on a holiday. You just have to manually send them. And you have to manually send them no later than like 810. Otherwise, it knocks it. It like drops against us. No, no, no. You're so lucky. You are so lucky, child. Ridiculous. Teach shapes to Rufus. Yeah, just, just teach shapes. These toddlers are getting bolder and bolder, y'all. These toddlers are definitely getting bolder. Mm-mm. Well, all right. We got all day for stuff. She will have to cook a meal. Yes, yeah, she will have to cook a meal here shortly. Yep, he stole a bath. Yep. 
All right, Rufus. Let's do this. Oh, mm, we, we might be getting up quick. Today's mail has been delivered, which I didn't sell last time's mail either. So. All right. Fingers crossed, y'all. Fingers crossed. All right. How you doing on this one? Okay, I think another round, but what should help? Yeah. Teach shapes to Rufus. Thank you. Um, but maybe that will allow his needs to go up for, to be good for a while. Which which one, the toddler or the teenager? All right, learn learn your shapes, please. Learn your shapes. Learn your shapes. Come on. It is possible for us to kick Adrian out. And I really need Melody to become a B student today. So I can age her up for the weekend. And of course, they circle the kitchen. All right. All right. Oh, since he stole a bath. Oh, all his other needs? You're right. It's possible. It's possible. We'll see. I don't know. All right. Make a grand meal. Let's go with the turkey dinner. All right. Go make a turkey dinner. And the toddler can grab one of these when he's done. Just fix his needs and all. Yeah, toddler, fix your needs. We did get to level two on that, so, like, bonus. All right, it's almost three o'clock, guys. It's almost three o'clock. Let's find out. All right, I'm getting you, you guys outside. You're getting in my way. Yeah, I need you outside. Hey, it's David! You're moving. All right. Congrats, I guess. All right, B student. Yes! An A student. Nice. You're mortified. Mm-hmm. Didn't I just move you out here? Why are you now circling the TV? These gnomes, I swear these gnomes are possessed. Mm -mm, these gnomes are absolutely possessed. Go take care of the baby and then come back and call everyone to a grand meal except for the toddler. Nope, toddler don't go. You Toddler goes to sleep. Everybody else comes to get food. Yep, all right. Okay, so while they're eating, hopefully Adrian's mortification will go down enough. Um, but I do need to do a very quick eye break. Um, yeah, do need to put some drops in, so I did save it just so we don't lose anything. Uh, for those that are confused as to what an eye break is, I def I need to put eye drops in. I do turn my camera off for this because it does squick some people, and I definitely do not want to do that. So, if you are not used to putting stuff in your eye in your eyes or touching your eyeballs, um, yeah, this is definitely kind of squeaky or weird for you. So, uh, give me uh, just a couple minutes to do this, and I will be right back, guys. Okay.
All right. Did we stretch? Did we do any bathroom breaks or anything? Or did we just sit and hang out? My money's on y'all just sitting and hanging out. Mm-hmm. Yep. That's what my money's on. You sat like a lemon. Did not move. That is fair. That is fair. All right. Soon as he demortifies himself, which you can't until these gnomes move. Ah, shoot. I did it again. No, we're not traveling. All right, go put all put all that stuff there. Great. Uh, where is in this? I need to find our pinned message that has the the chart. All right, so the guy with the arms up wants a coffee. The guy that just stands there like a lemon wants a coffee as well, and the naked one wants a toy. All right, so appease the gnome, give a toy. Wake up, come appease the gnome. You need to give them coffee. And you also need to give the gnome coffee. After that, you can sleep. Wait, really? Give them coffee, and then you come give toy. Yeah, I can't with y'all. Oh, he stank stank. Yes! Happiness! Alright, where did I put the... Oh, it's... No, that's not it. That's the presents. Do we not have the decorator box out anymore? Do I not have the decorator box? I thought I did. Didn't we? I thought we had the decorator box, guys. Oh, there it is. Oh, okay. I was going to say, I thought we had one. We do. That's kind of pretty. All right. Thank you. Now give yourself a pep talk. There we go. Uh, you think it's ironic? Hold on. Oh, uh, you think it's ironic that naked one wants a toy? Sin, you've been hanging around with Jake too long. All right, did I age you up and did I clear your inventory out? I think you're happy now. I did not clear your inventory, so give me your money. I did age... Oh, I didn't age you up. That's what it was. I needed to age you up. All right, we'll come here and age up. Blow your candles out. It's your birthday. All right, go blow your candles out. I'm kicking you out. Bye. All right, he's got a lot of moodlets. Add birthday candles. And birthday! All right, so Adrian is a squeamish, mean sim who wants to destroy everyone's love lives. That is also cheerful. Y'all, if this sim isn't a, a walking oxymoron, I don't know what is. But all right, do we like cheerful? If we like cheerful, then I will go ahead and lock it in in five, four, three... Two, uh, nope, as he wants to re-roll. Calm. Do we like calm? If we like calm, then I will go ahead and lock it in in five, 
four. Nope, Pouty Lobster. Recycle Disciple, and we have a Duck Duck coming in. Active. Hi, Wyatt, and hi, Bronco, dude. How are you? How is your day going? All right, so if we like active, then I will go ahead and lock it in in five, four, three, two, one, zero. All right, we will go with active then. Yes, yes, pet, pet the Wyatt, pet the Wyatt's. Pet the Wyatt, all the pets. Oh, and I'm so sorry, Pie Lobster. If we could get that refunded back. All right, I'm kicking you out. You ain't going nowhere. I'm kicking you out, though. All right, maintain, move into other household. You don't know Milo, which is probably a good thing. I'm not going to lie. It's probably a good thing because Milo's a little bit creepy. All right, moving in with Milo. Bye, Adrian. Then we have Melody. And that, welcome on in, Amanda Rains. Welcome in. Thank you for coming over from TikTok. All right, come play chess. I need you to play chess just to get your skill up. I need to get a whole skill level, and then you got to do a project. I may give you a moodlet solver. We'll see. Mom didn't super fish and baby care. What's wrong with her? Mm -mm. All right, go take care of her. And I think, how is the, how is the baby doing? Wonderful, 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 wonderful. Okay, go here. What skills did you need? Okay, we need a movement and we need a thinking. Wahaha. Okay, teach shapes to Rufus. No, she go hath yeeted, guys. Get your yeets in chat. She go hath yeeted. Just in time we did the supervision baby care, though. Just in time. All right, guys. I'm drum rolling on my thing with Twizzlers because I can. All right. We are sending the good vibes and the juju to the Sims randomizer. Inquisitive. All right. If we like inquisitive. Then I will lock it in in five. Dang it. I didn't even get to start the countdown. All right, clingy. If we like it clingy, then I will lock it in in five, four, three, two, one, zero. Oh, nope, we got a Sin coming in. Charmer. Ladybug Charmer again. Alright, you've used three. Clingy is worse than Fussy. Yes, Clingy is worse than Fussy. Uh, but at this point, Fussy's just a meme. But alright, nope, and Duck Duck. Fussy. Alright, y'all got an option. You got a choice here. You got a choice. Do we do another reroll? Do we get a five re-roll or do you go with a fussy? Last time you guys chose to go with a re-roll after a fussy, the person that did it regretted it. So, if we like it, then I will lock it in in five, four, three, two, one. Zero. All right, fussy it is. Get an exclamation point fussy in the chat. Mm -mm. Yeah! 
All right. Uh, play inside, make believe, play inside. We do need to get another dad over here pronto. I just realized we need to go seducing. Oh no, oh no, this is bad. Kenzie, this is your fault. I blame you. All right. All right, see, so what I'm going to do is the same as we've done before. I will start the poll and let me make sure which. Oh, really? So still, we only have closed out Little Mermaid. And, yeah, it was just Little Mermaid. Okay. So the next dad... Alright, now I get... Now I'm, I'm gonna... I'm gonna do something fun. Fun for me. Maybe not so fun for you guys, but fun for me. All right, filter, filter, filter. All right, wahahaha. Oh, -ha -ha -ha. Uh, let's see. This one's gonna be mean. And I'm here for it. All right, guys, you got Bruno 2, Luisa, or Kristoff, or Gaston, or Yzma. So let me show you. We have here is a Gaston. We have Gaston. We have Kristoff. We have a Bruno and a Bruno. I'm not going to tell you which one is up. And then I have a Yzma. And hi, Eddie Bitty Jane. How are you? How's your day going? No, I only gave you one Bruno this time, so y'all don't know which Bruno I picked for one and two today. I will tell you that the one that I picked for one and two is different than the one, than the order is different than it was on uh, the last Hunter Baby Challenge. Uh, oh, Louisa. Yes, I am so sorry. I meant to show you Lu Louisa. Here's Louisa. Yes, this is Louisa. Mm-hmm. And Nova Rose, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, share, and get comfy. So go ahead and vote. So yes, we have... Wait, that's not it. We have Gaston. Kristoff. Luisa. A Bruno. A Bruno. And then we have Yzma. So yeah, go ahead and vote. Welcome on in, Kristen. How are you? Happy Friday. All right. Make sure you're getting your votes in. Louisa. All right, guys. So that means that y'all have officially closed out Encanto for the donors. So that means neither Bruno will get picked. All right. I didn't want to tell you that before y'all voted for Louisa. I wanted to see if anyone remembered that. So, all right. Way to go for Louisa. That's why I said it was going to be evil. It was gonna be it was gonna be mean. But I do have to say I I do have to say both Brunos were amazingly done. They were really well done. 
Really, really, really well done. So yes, there is a chance that a Bruno may may show up in a in a different save. Mm -hmm. Yes. So really quick, we're going to save and go to manage roles. We're going to add them in. All right. I'm kind of surprised that that you guys didn't go for Yzma. I'm kind of surprised. Yeah, I don't have anyone in my thing. Okay. Oh, this is old. There we go. Move in. Yep, see, 935. So he has, Cole has 915, I think. Unless we have someone in there that shouldn't be. No, we don't. We don't. All right. But we are going to go visit them. Because uh, Mama needs to go seduce it. You wanted Yzma from the beginning? She's, yeah. Those of you that made Sims for this, like, y'all did amazing. Y'all did amazing. Cast Wizards, the lot of you. Any tips for this challenge? Uh, I have a couple. Um, I do have some on my TikTok. I need to make some more. Um, but the number one thing, um, if you are playing... My question would be if you're playing base game or if you have packs to play with. Um, because if you're playing with base game, I can give you base game only tips. Um, or if you if you have multiple packs, then I can kind of tell you uh, what items to pull out of the additional packs. Like, for example, if you have movie hangout, I found, I learned that um, babies, uh, not babies, toddlers can eat the popcorn. They can get the popcorn themselves. If you have get to work, use the baker's dozen display case because toddlers can feed themselves. Um, if you have a, um, which one was it? If you have dream home decorator, the, the play tent, toddler sleep gets up twice as fast. Um, if you have city living, get the basketball goal and dream big. Because Dream Big, after anywhere from four to six clicks, uh, four to six tries of that, you'll get the skill up to level three very fast. Um, and anybody, Jane, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, share, and get comfy. Uh, let's see what else. Um, I do on my TikTok. I do have the um, a way to get the babies to hush quickly. Um, it's just a circle, uh, but if you follow the circle. And, um, it'll make them shut up really fast. It'll also, if you have parenthood, get the parenthood skill up really quickly. Um, if you have parenthood, school projects. But only do a school project if the child is, if it's for kids, if the kid is level four in the skill that it's raising or higher. Um, otherwise you won't get as much extra credit. All right, Cole, I'm gonna make, need you to leave. Yes, leave. Leave both of you. All right, we are going to go romance, enchantingly introduce ourselves to you. Yes, enchantingly introduce yourself. Okay, come on, mom, come on. Be a three click. Who broke that? Someone broke it. We're going to have to fix it before we leave. Three click, three click, three click. Not a three click. Attempt to seduce, though. Yeah, att attempt to seduce, please. Thank you. All right, blow her a kiss. Hold hands. Good job, 
First kiss. All right, quickly before the baby comes back. This is awkward with the toddler right there. All right, you know what? No, come repair this. Come repair this. And then bring the child over to do this. Um, and Ver, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, share, and get comfy. All right, play dolls with Janae. Stop playing dolls. Go wake her up. We need to woohoo. I love how we're waking her up just to seduce her to woohoo. I can't. I can't. I can't. All right, kiss her again. Kiss her again. I, we need to woohoo. All right, there we go. Woohoo her. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's nice and all. Woohoo, please. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's nice. Can we woohoo? Thank you. All right. Excuse me, can you wake up, please? I need to, uh, romance you. Yes. I, yes. And the only reason why I'm panicking for those that have not seen the whole challenge, uh, is because she ages up in a little over a day. And we still have five more babies to go. Five more babies to go. This is, yeah, this is, yeah. 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 Mm-hmm. All right. Harvest Fest was awful. Well, I mean, you know, it's fine. You'll, you'll be okay. You'll be okay. <sighs> no. Can I discipline you? I can't. I can't. Well, you know what? I think... Oh, no. Who died? No! Copper died! That's so sad. I know that wasn't my circus or my monkey, but I kind of felt like I needed to. And there we go. We have gone into labor. We haven't even had your kid yet. Why are you acting like a scared parent? All right. You know what? We're going to travel. And we're going to bring... Wait, where is she? Louisa. Yeah, we're going to bring Louisa with us. And we're going to travel home. And we're going to lock her in the house. Alright, we're doing this. Alright. Alright. Because it's like a weird o'clock in the morning. It's weird o'clock in the morning. So, yeah. I think I'm going to lock her in our bedroom. Yeah, I think I'm going to lock her in Ariana's bedroom. Yeah, that's it. Seems, seems legit. Mm -hmm. The things you say at work and then you realize you're my circus, my monkeys, my circus, my monkeys. Yes. All right, where is actions add to group? Go here together. Go here together, thank you. And Silly Billy, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, share, and get comfy. All right, now I lock the door for... Everyone but her. 
I have baby at hospital. I mean, this is one way to capture a dad, I guess. I guess. All right. Oh, we need to do the prediction. I forgot about the prediction. I am so sorry. I know y'all love this. All right. Gambling if you think it is going to be a boy or a girl. Gamble away. Oh, no. If you bring them to the hospital, there's a glitch to where it sends them home. So I needed to keep her in a central location. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, also, too, guys, um, I should have finally, because uh, I had a couple of other things that I had to do last night, um, but I should finally have my um, werewolf pack reaction going up this afternoon. Um, it'll probably be this evening. So if you are not subbed to the YouTube, uh, the YouTube link just went into chat. Oh, and then there's also the, the TikTok as well. Mm-hmm. All right. I hope they one day fix this. By this, I mean fix the baby thing. All right. We have paused it, so we shall find out in a moment. I hope, I wish one day they'd fix this, because I really like this animation. It was cute. But yeah. All right. Are we almost done? Is it closed? Is it closed? It is closed. All right. 58% say boy, 42% say girl. Don't want to do that. I'm going to say since we just had a girl, we're going to have a boy. All right. Um, And Swiss Camp, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lot of chair, get comfy. It's a boy! I was right! Yes! Alright, it's a boy. Wahahahaha! Alright. Now, for babies, it's a different story. We have a lot of closed um, stuff. So... Lion King, Atlantis, the Lost Empire, Phineas and Ferb, Frozen, and the Little Mermaid are all closed for baby names. Do we have any additional ones that I just don't remember off the top of my head? There might be. Oh, and Kim Possible. Yes, and Kim Possible. So, anything not in those categories is available for the baby name. So, please give me the name and the universe that it is a part of and make sure that it is Disney. So, oh, Miko. Ah, I loved Miko. I loved Miko. Oh, okay. Hold on. There should have only been three that came through. Why did, why did it let me do more? Oh, because I didn't fix it. All right, there we go. All right. All right, there we go. So we will refund one of them back. All right. I fixed. I fixed. All right. I 
don't know who one of these is one of these are but okay that works all right so go ahead and vote in the poll all right so we have um miko dopey and camillo yes so i don't know who the last one is Oh, all right, guys. It looks like K Vogel has yeeted the poll. So the poll must immediately end. And we have Miko coming in and winning that. All right. Yes, I know I haven't watched it. Don't tell Kenzie or Sam. All right, so we have a Miko. Oh, oh now Kenzie's here. Kenzie, you didn't hear anything. Nothing. Nada. Zilch. Nothing. You heard nothing. Nope. I is Angel. Yes, I, I is Angel. Oh, I'm not boycotting Encanto. I just haven't had time. It's Disney I'm boycotting. Uh oh. Hi, Sam. Hi, Sam. What, what's with the sip? All right. All right. We, we're we're going to check the child names. All right. So, Miko, please be single. Please be single. Please be single. Yes, it's a single! All right, so single kid, we are now up to 96 babies. I assume you guys are in meetings because work. So, all right, let's let's go and let's go get let's go get preggy. Let's go get preggy. But you listen. That is fair. That is fair. You do listen. You do listen. Oh, okay. The, your microphone's off. Okay. As long as you guys aren't getting in trouble. That's my that's my number one thing is I I love being your co-workers and such, but please do not get in trouble on because of me. No one pays attention to meetings at work. That is true. That is true. I mean, unless you're the one presenting and then you kind of have to pay a little bit of attention. Um, but apart from that, yeah, you're right. Nobody pays attention. I mean, sometimes you might be you might be busy and might miss it. So yeah, you figure you get at least one warning. Th that is fair. That is fair. All right, where is she? Oh, good. She's right here. She's still here. Okay. Immediately. Oh, wait. No, we can't. We have to. Super efficient baby care. Why are you hungry? It doesn't fill your needs to max anymore. That makes me so sad. All right. And then. Try for baby. All right. Go super efficient baby care. Then try for baby. I know y'all y'all need help, but like we kind of need to do this more. So Yeah, I think don't you need to slide or something? Yeah, you just need a bunch of slides. So go slide. Yeah, go slide a bunch. You need to play in here. Yeah, go play. Are you, are you woo-hooing? 
I need you to I need you to woohoo, please. It's a woohoo in time, cause we gotta get preggy. All right, into bed. There you go. All right. Uh, one of your fun facts when you first started is that you're a mod on Twitch. Oh, uh, they didn't say anything about that. That's kind of cool. You've unmuted yourself to ask a question. Oh, you've heard me. They've heard me scream. Oh god, no! Oh god, that's <sighs> that's not good. Your your coworker, your like whoever's like on the other side of that meeting must think that like I've lost it. Preggy test? Okay, preggy test. Preggy test. I want a preggy test. Thank you. Wake up, preggy test. You can eat later. We got more important things to do. It took you an hour and 20 minutes to, to get pregnant. I know you're hungry. You'll get over it. Yes! We are pregnant! All right. Wanubu. <laughs> really? Really? All right, guys. Oh, sin coming in, in in the best possible moment in the best possible moment. All right. A round of applause for sin coming in and saving the dad. All the round of applause. The uh, dramatic scale did not even end before Sin was like, not on my watch. So, all right. Well, unfortunately, Sin, we still must find out if that was a good save or not. So... We still must find out. This means we will not be doing a prediction. But we still must find out, was it a good save or not? We'll find out in three, two, one. Oh. Sin, I am sorry to tell you that that was not a good use of your points. However, she either way, she was going to survive. So. Can we get some rips in chat for Sin's points? Yes, rips in chat for Sin's points. All, all the rips. But the good news is you have saved her. There you go. That's a hilarious shot of the two of them. But all right. Well, congrats. I do need to let her out though. We'll let her hang around since she's getting to live. I'm sorry, Sin. I'm sorry. Y'all really should try to get Wyatt to spend his points more to do these things. The one thing you can count on, though, is that Wyatt will use his points to try to force me to get a fussy toddler. That is the one thing that Wyatt is almost guaranteed to do. Because he likes the chaos. Mm -hmm, he does. Don't let him lie to you. He does like the chaos. No, you will do it because you love you love the the fussiness. You love the fussiness. 
All right, so you did you do your homework? Please tell me you did. You didn't do your homework. What the heck? Child, do your homework. Give that to mom. Yes, you can like video gaming. That's wonderful, but I need you to do your homework. And I am going to have mom buy one of those moodlet solvers. Potions, moodlet solver. Drink that and then do your homework. Yeah, drink that and then do your homework. Where are you going? I, I, whatever, it's fine. Um, I'm fine. You got not a problem, Max, not a problem. Go have fun this weekend. Enjoy yourself. Thank you for being with us. Thank you for hanging out. I guess all the picks in the Discord. Um, yes. All, all the picks. Can we get some mod love in at chat for fearsome, please? Oh, school time. Well, there's no time for you to do your homework, so we're just going to have to, like, send you now and hope and pray that that was enough. Yeah, go to school. Go to school. Thank you. Work normally. Immediately study hard. All right. Thank you, Chucky. And hi, Amy. How are you? How is your day going? It's a, have a wonderful weekend. Wonderful, wonderful weekend. Mm-hmm. All right, um, I think it's just you that needs stuff. Yeah. Grab a serving once you finish that, and then we'll just teach this child to do whatever. She go. She go could use some potty. Yeah, she go could use some potty help. Thank you. And thank you for the host, Rachie. Thank you, thank you. Yes, guys, hosting is a free way to help the channel. If you host, uh, that puts us on more people's recommended uh, channels. So that way we can try to make some new friends. So there is the information on how to host if you would like. If you have BTTV installed, then there is a button that you can click right underneath uh, the video on this channel to host. And it automatically does it for you. Thank you, Frost. All right, yes, we are doing some pottiness. You are eating. Ooh, you also need to potty. Give it the best shot. Performance gain small. All right. I thought I told you to teach her to potty. I mean, all right, teach. Teach us other stuff, but okay. All right. Where are you going? Oh, now you're going to potty. Okay. Okay. Yes, and then shapes. Shapes it up. No! Who died? Ashley, am I? I, I don't know who that is. I don't know who that is. Why are all of my grandchildren dying all of a sudden? I do not understand this. I, I do not understand this. Alright, do another flashcards then, I guess. Flashcards. Needs. Thank you. No, bud. Not right now. We'll go out in a bit, okay? Lay down, please. Lay down. How much food do we have? Oh, we got plenty. Well, that's going to go that's going to get spoiled, but you know what? It's fine. It's... Potty trained Shigo. I thought we already did that. Well, 
She goes already a pain in my patootie and I don't like it. I don't like it one bit. Nope. Alright, finish your shapes. Oh, you okay? That had to hurt. He just whacked his head on the side of the desk. He's currently on half medication, so he's a little bit more active than normal today. So, uh, if... yeah, I'm not sure what he's going to do. Right now, he's just standing and staring into space. Um, but that's because we ran out of one of his medication because Chewie was delayed. <gasps> oh, money! Under what conditions? This is the third time we've gotten that. Nice. Um, so, yeah, so he's a little out of sorts right now. Little out of sorts. He also decided that he wanted to try to go hunting last night. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. I, uh, I just put her to sleep. I cannot with y'all. Cannot with y'all. All right, Rufus, how you doing? Yeah, he caught wind of a bunny rabbit. Yep, he caught wind of a bunny rabbit. And for a dog like Apollo, that's all it took. Yes, Melody is an A student! I was so afraid she wouldn't be, but she is, and that means that I can now age her up. Come here, go here. I need you to be a teenager, please. Whew, sorry about that. That came on real fast. And hi, Allie. How are you? How is your day going? Thank you. I hope I paused in time. I try to pause so I don't sneeze in your ears. Thank you, Helena. I haven't sneezed in a bit on stream, so there is that. Days go okay. I'm doing good. I'm doing good. It has been a very interesting, interesting stream. All right, so. Let's see. Out of six. Seven. This will be out of two. Oh, wants to get be rich and famous. All right. So Melody is a mean sim who is also a slob. Keep in mind, y'all. This is Melody from Little Mermaid too. I'm just saying. But anyway, all right. If we like slob for her, then I will go ahead and lock it in in five, four, three, two, one, zero. All right, we'll lock in slob for her. Oh, satellite bunny. And, and hi, live, love, live in love. How are you? How is your day going? All right, Gloomy. If we like Gloomy, then I will go ahead and lock it in in five, four, three, two, one, zero. All right, I will lock in Gloomy, which actually the Gloomy thing kind of fits her. It kind of fits. All right, add birthday candles. Wee! I know you can't eat that. Do you need to eat, though? You don't really, but I'll make you eat anyway. Are you good? You have to stay home all week because you have COVID. Oh, that sucks. I'm sorry. I am sorry. That is never a fun situation. Hopefully, it is a mild case. Oh, what kind of dog do I have? He is. Oh, uh, well, I would move the chair to show you him. Um, he is 
Let's see. His breeds are Chow Chow, Black and Tan Coon Hound, American Pit Bull, Terrier. Um, he's got Rottweiler, German Shepherd, Collie, Cocker Spaniel, and then like a mixture of other stuff. Uh, if you do exclamation point Apollo IG in chat, it'll send you to his Instagram, which I need to update. I'm very bad about updating Instagram. But, yeah. IG, there you go. There's his Instagram. And I think it's just Apollo. Yeah. He is also one of our, um, I think it's just Breed Frost. I think it's Breed. Um, he is also our mascot and he has his own emote. Um, and Megs, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, and get comfy. No, you cannot go in the, oh, I forgot to uh, relock this. Get, get over here. Leave the baby alone. Get out. Get out. Thank you. All right, locked door for everyone but her. Thank you. Um, and live and love, baby. Thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, share, and get comfy. All right, let's assign these beds and let's get them. I'm trying to decide what what skill should she have. I think because it's the weekend. Let's have her do guitar. Yeah, let's have her go do guitar. I like that. And hi, Sarah Squad. How are you? How's your day going? And yes, I did do a breed reveal of his um, breed using Embark DNA. Um, and I did put that on my inst on my uh, YouTube channel. So, yeah. Oh, you're good trying to force yourself to get up to go to the store. Nice. Nice. I need to go to the store. Will I go to the store? Probably not. Probably not. Probably not. But yes, um, there, Embark gives you a cute little breed video, breed reveal video if you do it. Um, it's, it is not sponsored by them. I would love that, but it was not. All right, thinking level three. Nice. Nice. Was that your last thing you needed to do? Can I age a baby up? I almost can. I almost can. Go here. All right, why are you, what was all that? Why didn't you go do that? All right, whatever. There we go. Perfect. Ah, oh, we doing this. We getting rid of a toddler. All right, candles help from mom. Woohoo. Oh, yes. No, you are not going to sleep. You are going to age up and then you can go sleep in a real bed. So, um, we are currently at, oh, I forgot. Now I didn't. All right. So we are currently at 96 out of a hundred kids. That's wild. We are currently at 96 out of 100, and, um, yeah, so Rufus, I believe, Rufus is the young, is the child that will not be moving out in order to make sure we don't go over 100. So, oh, I just realized something, guys. Babies. After this pregnancy, it could technically end if we get triplets. So if Louisa only has one, the next dad could theoretically and technically be the only, um, like, be, she could be the second to last dad. Yeah. She could definitely be the second to last one. So... Yeah, it, it's definitely, definitely interesting. All right, let us get him aged up. Yes, 97 if we include Apollo, yes. I was not planning on including Apollo, 
in in that list, but okay. Let go of the cake. Let go of the cake. Thank you. All right, so Rufus has aged up. He is going to become a... All right, what is with all of this game today and mean? We've gotten almost nothing but mean sims today. I don't like it. Rufus is not mean. Sometimes you shouldn't let go of the cake. Yes. All right, y'all. Are we going to keep mean for Rufus? This does not fit the character at all. And this is also the, the third mean sim we've gotten. Thank you, Munchkin. All right, Perky. Do we like Perky? And yes, Perky is a CC trait. Um, I have it listed on my CC list. Nope, an angle. We got two. Okay, Cat Lover. All right, all right. This is Rufus from Kim Possible, by the way. So, all right, if we like a cat lover, then I will go ahead and lock it in place in five. No, Patty Lobster. Perfectionist. If we like perfectionist, then I will go ahead and lock it in in five, four, three, two, one. Nope, Nana. Socially anxious. All right, guys, you can either go with this one or you have one more re-roll available to you. But if we like this and we do not want to re-roll, then we will lock it in in five, four, three, two, one. Nope, an angle. Okay, if we could refund Pouty Lobster's traits back, uh, traits, uh, points back, please. Green Fiend. All right. Interesting. Very interesting. Ooh, you tired. We're gonna sign this bed to you. I'm gonna send you straight to sleep. All right, so Kinsey, that was Green Fiend for Rufus. That's a lot of gifts. That's what I was... I was wondering if that's what y'all were going for. If y'all were going for the bingo or not. I was not sure. Alright, let's see how much money we make in today, friendos. Alright, we got these, we got this, we got this, we got this, we got this. I'm gonna say 6,000 with all of these in here. I could be wrong, you never know. All right. Oh, 7.9. All right. I was under this time. Better than being over. All right. What are you doing? Are you cleaning? Yeah, you're cleaning. All right, so once she finishes this... Oh, uh, yeah, we'll have her make some food on the grill. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And thank you, Allie. Yes, it is on the, the gallery. So if you'd like to download it, it is on the gallery for everybody to uh, play in. It kind of gives off a Beauty and the Beast vibe. So, yeah, I, lo I love it. This is one of my favorite ones we've been in. Actually, no, I would say this is my favorite house out of all the houses. This is definitely my favorite. Mm -hmm. So, all right, come here and grill. I'm gonna, we're gonna grill just regular burgers, I think. Yeah, just grill some regular burgers. Thank you. This just reminded you to check your grill. Have to make sure your dinner is cooking. Yes. Yes. I do not have a grill. Oh, wait, is she still playing the guitar? Oh, she's fine. I forgot I sent her to go do the guitar. All right, she go. 
I'm gonna send you to sleep. Yeah, I'm gonna- I'm just gonna send you to sleep. Yep. Once she go ages up to a young adult, then we'll change her clothes to all green. Thank you for reminding me to take a drink. Alright, so today's bingo dobs are kid slash toddler passes out, grandkid dies, toddler seeks a bath, a fussy toddler, child dies, yeet the pole, a single birth, save the dad, coin flip lives. I remembered the baby counter and I remember the birth certificate and we got a five trait reroll. So, quite a lot of dobs today. Unlike last time when we had like no dobs. It was like the very last part of the st of stream that we had dobs popping in. So, all right, go, go, go eat some food and I'm really not sure what to have mom. So this is where y'all ended up. I forgot you existed. This is where they ended up in a summoning circle around the death flower. Yep, yeah, that tracks. That tracks. A hundred percent that tracks. Yes, thank you. I have not saved in a while. I've already proven on TikTok that the um, gnomes in the game are evil. I've already proven this. Open present and sneak a present. Let's 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 abuse the presents glitch. And hi Sims Lover, how are you? We are doing 100 baby today and we are at 96 out of 100 kids. Uh anyone else have a storm coming this afternoon? I do not. I had a storm happen yesterday when it wasn't supposed to. Really? We got a poop pile of poop? Nah, pass. Pass. A ceramic cookie jar. All right. All right. That's not... Yeah, that's not for us. Oh, wait. How much stuff do I have in my inventory by chance? I don't think we've checked it in a while. 62! Cool. Yep. All right. We got them all. Uh, it's been a while since it's been on. Nice. Yeah, you had a storm yesterday. Yeah, storms in this time of year are nice. I like them. Um, I just don't like them when I'm told to put stuff outside to dry out. And it starts raining. And yes, guys, I, I did give Mama Bella crap about it today when she was over. She was not thrilled. But you know what? It's fine. I'm at Midwest. I'm Midwest. So I'm like almost smack dab in the middle of the country. Yeah, um, almost smack dab right there in the middle. Uh, take a shower. I think that's... Yeah. And then, yeah, I think I will let her go play video games. Yeah, I think I will let her play video games. Uh, Sim Scuffle. Um... And I do apologize, I do not unfortunately know how to uh, read your name out, but thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana, grab a drink, grab a lunch, share, and get comfy. What, did you lose your popcorn, Wyatt? I'm sorry. Um, you haven't had a storm in exactly a week? Oh, let's see, after, except for yesterday, I think it only had only been a couple of days. Typically, this time of year, I do get a lot of storms. And yes, it is. Yes, it is. Yes, um, it, so the follow alert is the communicator, uh, because we love KP here. I apps like, she was, like, everything to me, uh, when that came out. 
Um, and welcome on in, welcome on in. Who are you? Vittore. Hold up, who is your par- who are your parents? Excuse me? Hold up. Hold up. Is that our Addy? Please don't be our Addy. Oh no. Now now I'm afraid. Now I'm afraid. Okay, that's copper. Oh no. Oh no, guys. Oh no. Truly, oh no, Rory. Oh, it is! It is! It's her youngest. No, it's her middle one. Okay, so this is a grandkid. All right. All right. Wait a minute. All right. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Um, I was confused for a second there. Well... Apparently, apparently this, apparently Addie and uh, Lilith got together at some point, did some woohooing, and this is the product. All right. Good to know, I, I guess. I guess. Sam, are, are you, are you taking people's popcorn? Well, I mean, it's better than a donor. It is better than a donor. It's still weird, but it's better than a donor. It is better than a donor. I will give you that. All right, but the good part is Melody's now done. Except for homework and a project. So I'm happy. No, it was for science. Oh, okay. So it was for science. Gotcha. It was for science. All right, clean that up, please. What does she need, actually, apart from homework? Do homework. Oh, wait, mom has all the projects. Looks like you're doing electricity. There you go. That works. You can't believe Kim Possible's turning 20 years old this year. I know, right? Wait, is it this year? When did, when was it released? Two thousand two. You're right. Yeah. And literally the only reason that um, the show ended is same reason like with Lizzie McGuire. Because at the time, Disney had a limit of how many episodes they would make for a show. Mm-hmm. Yep. So it would just, it came to a natural end. It wasn't actually, fun fact, until Phineas and Ferb that they did away with the um, uh, episode limit. So, yeah, we can, we can thank Phineas and Ferb for, um, taking away the, the limit. 
they also they were going to remake it. Um, they attempted with a live action that just flopped. It massively flopped. And then there goes another grandkid dying. I don't know who that is. I'm sorry. But yeah, so yeah, the live action flopped. I felt bad for the actors in it. Uh, but they, first and foremost, they changed her outfit. And I was like, why would you change the outfit? Like, it was, it's so... Uh, okay, there was a bunch of cats or dogs there. All right. Uh, but yeah... Uh, you know, the show was originally going to end season three. Fans all over the world demand another season. Yeah, yeah. So they basically, they kept it going. They kept it going. And I'm glad they did. I'm glad they did. But I do have some ground. Wait a minute. I just looked at it. What, what days did it first air? Hold on. What was the f first air date? June 7th. What's June 7th? June 7th is a Tuesday and it's Taco Tuesday. Guys, guys, I think, I think, I think, hear me out, hear me out, hear me out. I think on Tuesday, on Tuesday, we should um, do a Kim Possible build, maybe. What do we think? What do we think? Should we do a Kim Possible build on Tuesday? I'm thinking we should. I, I'm thinking we should build Kim's house. I'm, I'm thinking we should build the house. Because I think that could be fun. I don't know if it's possible. We might have to do Ron's house. Um... No, I think it could be possible. I'm looking at it. Yeah, no, it should be... It could be. Yeah, I think we can do it. I think we can definitely do it. Yeah. Definitely think we should. All right. Did you finish your homework? You did. That's amazing, Melody. Now you can do extra credit work. All right, y'all. We got a red alert toddler. Red alert toddler coming in hot. Coming in hot. Who's also about to pee herself. I mean, alright. It is what it is. Did you do your homework? You didn't even start it. Fail, child. Fail. Alright, let's, let's do a... All right, so go ahead and vote in the poll. So Tuesday, June seventh is Kim Possible is the anniversary of Kim Possible twenty year anniversary. Should we build her house, or should we build something from the show? Okay, so go ahead and vote. Yes, we should build something, or should we just have nachos for dinner? Nachos, if you don't know, is nachos and tacos mixed together into one. Yeah, no, my toddlers are never happy. She's too busy peeing herself at the moment to really care about anything. Oh, she did eat. She did eat. All right, all right. Well, oh, you need everything. All right, come here and slide. I just need you to slide. Slide till you get your movement all the way up. Okay, thanks. Bye. And you also need to go to sleep. And once you wake up, I am just going to queue all sorts of things up for you. Um, and studies, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, share, and get comfy. Um, what dads? So, we only actually have room for up... 
anywhere from three. Yeah, so it could potentially be one to three more dads. So that is the those are the last ones that we can that we can have. Uh, we are currently pregnant with Luisa Madrigal's baby, so there is that. Um, but yeah, if she has a single birth, the next one could potentially end it for us. Mm-hmm. Yes, the next one could end it for us. All right, come on. Rufus has completed his homework. Congrats to Rufus. Oh, wait, you're a C student, aren't you? Rar, you are. Okay, that's fine. And you need to go do mental things. Go do your mental things. Okay, bye. Then we got Shigo. You know what? Since mom is doing good, go here. We're going to have mom teach her logic stuff. Because she needs attention. So, yeah. Nope. You're done. Uh, friendly flashcards teach basic needs. Alright, you guys want to, you guys said you want to build something from it. Okay, we can do that. We can do that. Mental level two. Wait, where are you going, child? Where are you going? Come back here. Thank you. Maybe we could play with the K with the Kim Possible characters in The Sims for a day. We could, we could. Yes. Um, and Brianna, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the Cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, share, and get comfy. I may make the sim. May, we may make them in, in cast. I don't know. We'll see. I'll basically I'll probably plan a day around that, since that is the like the ring that is the follow and alert and everything. We might as well. Yeah, we might as well. That could be fun. Um, and Desiree Alexis, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, share, and get comfy. That could, yeah, the more I think about it, the more we could really turn it into a whole thing. Yeah. Yeah, like start off with cast, then maybe do a little bit, then maybe do a little bit of building or gameplay or something. Possibly. We could possibly do that. If I was faster at editing speed builds, I'd do a speed build of one of the houses. But I'm just really slow at, build, at those. And hi, Desiree. How are you? Welcome on in. Welcome on in. Get back here. No, come here and babble. You're gonna babble while mom takes care of the baby. It's okay. Oh, and she's hungry. Of course she's hungry. She's always hungry. Grab a serving. Yeah, everybody's always hungry in this house. Everyone's always hungry. Everyone's always tired. You yeah, know, it is what it is. It's the joys of the Hunter Baby Challenge. Yeah, everyone's always a mess. Always, always, always a mess. All right. I love that we're still making money off these books, even though we haven't written one in a long time. That's just funny to me. Okay. Um, I think you can potty train Shigo really quick. Yeah, come potty train Shigo. Please and thank you, because Shigo desperately needs to be potty trained. Oh, my lord. Uh, what are we going to do when we complete the challenge? So, I actually have a command for that. Um, but I will explain it a little bit more in detail. Um, after this, since we are going we are very close to it, I am going to take about two months to focus on our other two challenges that we have going on. So, we have the Elemental Legacy, which is a challenge that I created with my friend Jake. We just started the Animal Generation, so we're working on the vet career. Um, and then we are going to go back to our not so berry which we are finishing up the plum gin getting ready to start orange 
So we're going to do that, a little bit of that. And then once I get a little bit of a break from toddlers, then we're going to restart the 100 Baby Challenge with a um, Countryside Spellcasters version. So we'll be living in Henford on Bagley and the matriarchs will all be spellcasters. So that will be the requirement in order to be the next matriarch. They have to be a spellcaster. Um, and I will be using a variety of mods with it. We will have aging during the pregnancy turned on. It's going to be a lot of fun. Um, so at this point, I think I've done it as extreme as I can. Um, at least with the tools that I have right now. Um, because the first one that I did, I did the hunter baby in like 12 ish weeks, something like that. Um, and I had four matriarchs and I did it again with two matriarchs. Now I've done it with one and I've done it with one. Hopefully we'll finish this with her still being a young adult. So after that point, I'm not really sure what, like what all else we can do to push it, um, to make it even more extreme. The only other thing that I can think of is that she has to live in a tiny home the entire time. Um, uh, but that doesn't seem like it'd be a lot of fun. So yeah, we're just, now we're going to take it and we're going to explore and we're going to see, all right, we've seen what the base version of the game can give us. Let's see what kind of chaos we can create with mods. So that'll be fun. And hi, Allie B. Welcome on in. Welcome on in. I don't know what I said. I don't know what I said. He just started saying, I said I did a thing. So yes. Um, and yes, the toddler's name is Shigo. Uh, the community gets to vote, gets to submit names, and they get to vote on names uh, whenever we give birth to a new kid. Um, and James, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, share, and get comfy. This is from the uh, toddler stuff pack. Uh, this and also this tree is from the same pack. I love it. I think it's a very cute pack. Uh, it also comes with a ball pit. And a couple of other really cool things, um, if you see, which actually I don't think I put them in this house, which is shocking because normally I do. Normally I use these lights and everything, but apparently I didn't. So toddler stuff pack, where you are, where you at? Here it is. Toddler stuff pack. Um, so it's these lights right here. I love these lights. So if you see people using these, these are from the toddler stuff pack. They're very pretty, very cute. Um, oh, these pillows right here are also the stuff pack. Um, we have a cooler. We have the artist rug. Uh, looks like there's dolls. Oh yeah, this grill. Balloons. A weird makeshift tent thing, which I'm not sure what that is. Picnic table. Um... An imitation director's chair all those fun things um, but this is what a lot of people don't realize is there's a whole jungle gym just for toddlers so yeah it's, it's a lot of it's a lot of fun and oh so the slide gets movement up the tree house gets um, imagination up and um, the jungle gym gets uh, both imagination and uh, their movement skills up. All right. Um, I think she, so she did hit potty level two. I think after this, we might. Hmm. I think I may set her loose away from mom. I think I may. I think we may just let her go off on her own and send mom to go do other things. Yeah, I think that's probably going to be the best bet. Oh, no, we are sending mom to sleep because mom's about to pass out and I'm not giving you guys another bingo dob. I am not giving you all the, all, yeah. 
I, I am not I am not giving y'all another bingo dob. Absolutely not. I gave you too many freebies today. I'm gonna make y'all work for it. I'm gonna make you work for it. Stay in bed. Thank you. I love how she's working on this outside in the rain. That's hilarious. Uh, sure. Give my number away, I guess. Cole, you asked at the worst time. He asked at the worst time, guys. All right, here's the thing. Do we get do we take a a sleep replenisher and go on a date with Cole? Or do we ask him out on a date once we've slept? What do we think, guys? What do we think? Cuz we are we are at the point to where they're supposed to be getting engaged. Yes, I know this. Um, do we do we do this now? Do we go on a date with him or do we or do we sleep? And then, um, plan a date out to where we propose to him. So, yeah, so what, what, do, what do we want to do? Do we want to, yeah, so do we want to, um, go on a date with him or do we want to sleep now and then plan the engagement date? So let me let me do it. Let me do a poll really quick because I'm really curious. So do we sleep replenisher and go or sleep now? All right. So do we sleep now and play in the big date later? Um, and Danny Days, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, share, and get comfy. Yeah, go ahead and vote. So do we go on the date now? Or do we sleep now and plan a big date um, for Sunday? Or do we do two dates back to back? Because uh, if we do the sleep replenisher and go, we will have to plan an additional date with him to get engaged. Because I'm not having her get engaged today. I didn't plan for it. I didn't plan that into today. But yeah, so do we go on a date with him and max out our romance? And then on the next date, we just get engaged. I'm very, I'm very curious on what, what on what you guys think. All right, y'all, do not tie this pole on me. What the heck? Do not tie the pole. So, yes, yeah, so basically, if we go in this one, we'll go on a... Actually, yeah, so if we go in this one, we'll be going on another date with him. For those that are unaware, Cole is our end game. So Cole is who we are going to be marrying um, at the end of the challenge. So... We started off by having a casual fling with him to get our first kid. Um, he survived the first 50-50, so we took that as a sign that they were meant to be. And um, in the second set, they rekindled their romance. In the third set, they started dating. And now in the fourth set, at the end of the fourth set, they are going to get engaged. Uh, but they're not going to get married until after she raises the last child. And the last child is ready to move out. So, all right. By one, you said sleep now. Okay. So, I think what we'll do since it's two. Actually, it's probably, you guys are probably right. It's probably better. So, sandbar. That's where you wanted to go. No, I clicked the wrong thing. Dang it. Ah I clicked the wrong thing. All right. I clicked okay and I meant to click cancel. 
I didn't move the mouse down far enough. Dang it! I was just going to say, it'd probably be better to wait till after dark. Because he can't be out in the sun. This sucks! Alright then. What did you vote for, Sam? What did you vote for? We'll have to plan the big date anyway. Oh, this is the one. Oh, gosh. Sorry, dude. I lost the coin. I had to get it. <sighs> All right. Thankfully, it's overcast. Thankfully. All right. Share a secret with him. And we are going to have to buy a sleeper. Actually, let me see. Do we need sleep replacement or mood? Oh, just a sleep replacement. Yeah, we just need a sleep replacement. All right. So apparently we're doing this anyway. Sure. Why not? Drink. Okay. And flirt with him. Enthused about vampires. Let him know that we're enthusiastic about him. Oh, the tie. Oh, okay. That. Yep. Mm hmm. Am I surprised Sam was trying to tie the pole? I was not. I'm not. No. All right. Romance. Caress cheek. Be cute. Be cute. All right. Wait, can I buy something from you? No, I can't buy anything. I was going to say I need a coconut for one of the things. Why did that not work? Romance. Blow a kiss. Get get the romance bar up. We need him to be absolutely smitten with us. All right, romance. Compliment appearance, sure. Um, express fondness, sure. I know, he risked a date on a beach. Compliment his outfit. It is raining and all, but like, seriously. And Rinny, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, share, and get comfy. He's literally standing in the rain. Hey, okay, he must really like her. He must really, really like her. All right, what else can we do? Suggestive conversation. Attempt to seduce. Sure. Just because we're pregnant doesn't mean we can't seduce. All right. Oh, there's more beach chickens. Hi, beach chickens. All right. Is there any way? Oh, okay. Are we in the right spot? Is Can we? Hold on. Can you go over and do anything in this waterfall? You cannot. I was, because I know there's a waterfall in this world that you can woo, that you can woohoo in. Can we get to it from here? I don't think we can. I don't think we can. I love how she's still talking to him, even though, like, I'm nowhere nearby. Yeah, we can't get to it from here. Dang, that would have been really cute. That would have been really cute. Oscar, go away. I'm on a date. I am on a date. You can, yeah, attempt to seduce. Oh, he's telling us a vampire story, guys. Oh, it's a dramatic story. It's still a vampire story because he said bats and vampires. Yeah. 
Now where he's now where is he running off to? Cassian was not one of ours, was it? No, Cassian was. <gasps> no, Cassian was from Akatar. No, that's kid number seventy-two. Wait, hold on. We skipped quite a few kids there. Hold up, hold up, hold up. We skipped quite a few kids. Alright, so hold on. Okay, so Pippa had... How many kids? Four kids? I mean, alright, alright. What about Shizuka? Shizuka had... Y'all, you see this? Do y'all see this? She had one, two, three, four, five, six, seven kids. She ain't dying for a while. She really said, nope, I'm extending my life. All right, then we got to look for Truly. Because I don't think Truly, I think Truly still alive as well. There's Apollo. Where's Truly? Or did Truly already pass? Because that's Pippa. This is Reed. So Reed would be the next one to go. Theoretically. It's Voldy, Aaron, Fat Amy, Iris, Copper... Eloise, 13, Rory, I, oh wait, here's Truly, Truly had three kids, which, uh, that's kind of more what I would expect, alright, so, Chizuka really was like, I'm going for the kids, because we knew, wait, Wolf, did, Wolf did pass away, right, yeah, we knew Wolf passed away, yeah, Wolf passed away at the start of stream, and then Cassian just did. Uh, but Shizuka's not going to pass away for a while. Uh, Pippa and Truly may, but Reed most likely from Premonition will be the next one to go. Wow. I mean, th that is true. Mom is going for 101. She is. So, I can't, like, yeah. It's just odd. But all right, hang on. Where did Cole go? Cole ran away. Where where did our boyfriend go? We lost our boyfriend. Wait, no, I don't want that. Focus the camera. Oh, he's right there. Oh, I didn't realize that was a bathroom. Cool. All right, sit together. Come sit together. Stop your conversation and come sit together. You are on a date. You need to be snuggling. Plus, if you sit under here, you shouldn't need a umbrella. I say shouldn't, but you never know. Come on, Cole. Come sit. Come sit and snuggle. They're so cute together. All right, is there a snuggle? Snuggle. I don't know why they have to get up and, and to do that, but okay, whatever. Whatever, it works. It works. And yes, guys, if you have a bingo, make sure that you drop it in the um, general chat so that way the mods can verify it. Don't call me ever! Excuse me? <laughs> Just because y'all glitched into each other. Nah, -uh. where, where's the, where's the shower? Is there an out, is there a shower thing anywhere? Or like a bush, a woohoo bush? I feel like we need a woohoo bush. Can we woo? We can't woohoo in there. Well, that's rude. 
That's so rude. Okay, suggestive, sure. Romance. Snuggle. I don't care that we're not on a date anymore. Don't you dare. Blow him a kiss. Blow him a kiss. He's mad. Yeah, okay. We, we gotta fix this. We gotta fix this. He See, he's mad at us now. Profess undying love to him. Let's see if that works. I know. They're like mad at each other, but they're sucking face. I don't I don't get it. Alright, there we go. Now it's now, now he's leaving us. You know what? Forget this. <sighs> this is bad. I can't. I can't. That that was ridiculous. Just go home. Go home. Bellabot, read the room, please. All right. Well, yep. okay. I mean, it is what it is. It is what it is. Will y'all ever let me fix her? Just out of curiosity, will y'all ever let me fix her? No. She needs to be fixed. She needs to be fixed. Alright, this child needs food. So come get some food. What do you need? Rufus needs food, but also needs mental skills. So you're going to get your mental skill up first. Did you ever finish your project? You did not. So go finish your project. Because then you also have to do a project, Rufus. Yeah. Yeah, sorry to bust your bubble. No? But I, I want to fix her. She needs to be fixed. She needs help. She needs help, but y'all will let me fix her. Clean that, yeah. All right, let's see what. how much money we gonna make today. Not much. We are not making much money today. Yep, that sucks. I'm gonna say 2K. That's being generous. Oh, okay, 3K, 3.2K. That's not bad. That's not bad. All right, everybody's hungry, so everybody come get food. That works. I can fix her when I give up Hot Pockets. I don't eat, I don't eat pizza rolls, though. I mean, tater tots are delicious. Tater tots are delicious. I will not stand for slander such as this. Tater tots are absolutely delicious. Absolutely delicious. They are. Okay, okay. I I need you, I need y'all to 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 tell me. Are tater tots good? Are tater tots good? All right, vote vote in the poll. Do do y'all do y'all like it? Do y'all like tater tots or not? Vote in the poll. Do you like are tater tots good? Yes or no? Pass. I say yes. I I really say yes. Well, okay, yeah, yeah. For yeah, Darla did make a good point. Um, only when they're hot. If they're cold, they're not as great. Sometimes they're tolerable when they're cold. Majority of the time, they're disgusting when they're cold. You prefer fries. Okay. No, that's a fair thing. That's a fair thing. 
okay, yes, it also depends on what dipping sauce you have, yes. Uh, so imagine you have your dipping sauce of choice, and you have a choice between tater tots and... Yeah, if it, you just basically, like, you have the option of getting tater tots. Um, would you get them, and do you think they are good or not? I think they're good. I think they're delicious. I have eaten just tater tots for dinner before and been completely happy. But the mods are of the opinion that that is not real food. Really good with chili and cheese? Ooh, I would need to try that. Um, and Jay Lovely, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, and get comfy. At the bar you used to work at made Jock's Tots, which was tater tots, bacon, cheese, topped with barbecue ranch sauce. Ooh. Melanie, that sounds really interesting. And what are they? So, um, essentially they are, um, like little mini hash brown bites is the best way that I can describe them. Yeah. Oh, uh, you love Sonic's Tots. We actually don't have a Sonic near me. I used to have a Sonic and then they closed it to move it to a different location and then just never reopened. And we were all very confused. Real, for, real food versus delicious is two different questions. In my mind, it's all the same thing. All right, quick, get inside. Go inside. Go here. Go here. Go here. Go here. Go here. Go here. Clean up. All right, you're inside. Everybody's inside now, I think. Absolutely not. Did you? Shigo, you little snot. Shigo, you little snot. Ah. Oh. Now I'm mad. <laughs> That's two in one stream. Sam, you did not. You did not override the poll. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. I got to see what Sam did to this. Hold up. Yeah, Sam's using 3k points to override the poll. Tater tots are good. Squeeze it, me, Sam. Uh-huh. Of course, Shigo would be the problem child. Are we surprised? No, we're not. <sighs> Go potty. I don't pay attention to them, and they go and do this and pull the... Mm-mm. I'm not here for this. All right. Clean, clean all of these while she's doing that, please. Thank you. Cheaper than eating it. That is fair. That is fair. Uh, you enjoy causing chaos with Sam too much? Sam is chaos personified. Mm-hmm. Yep, that, that's what we came to the conclusion. Was that Sam was chaos personified. Yep, pretty much. Pretty much. All right, shapes. Just sit here and do a, do a few shapes. And we'll maybe have mom teach you or something. She 100% though is chaos personified. Mm hmm Nope, you do not empty trash. It is, no, it is absolutely revolting outside. I will do that for you. Thank you. Chaos and heating? Yes. Yes. Uh, we, that, it, that happens a lot here. Yeah, that, that happens a lot here. It's it's chaotic sippage is kind of like the theme for this community um, because they cause chaos and then they sip at me. Yes. Yes, they really do. They really do. Mm -hmm. We do, Sam. We do. I know, but then Sam wronged the tots. So...
Yeah, I don't know. If you're in the Discord, actually, you know what? Because I think it's going to be hilarious. Um, hold on. Where is it? Do oh, there's only one version of it? I was going to say, if you can get the Mercedes Jones tot sign, like, post that. But there's, like, a really terrible version of it. I'm still going to post it, but it's, like, really terrible. It, like, cuts off and, like, yeah, it's terrible. But that's kind of what I feel like. Should I should be just holding a sign up that says tots. Yes. They are delicious. They are delicious. Absolutely delicious. Absolutely delicious. All right, let's finish. Let's finish their thinking, please. I need you to to think, cause Shiko's supposed to be smart. Oh wait, your project's outside. I don't want any kids out. Oh, it's not even. Psh. Start working carefully. It's not even. Yeah, it's not even raining that hard. Wait, nope. You can't start working carefully yet. You did not complete your mental skill. Quick. They do not taste like soggy fried cardboard. They do not. They only taste like that if they are cold. I promise. They only taste gross if they are cold. I Yeah. Otherwise, they taste really good. But here's the kicker, though, guys. Would you rather have the crinkle fries or tater tots? Would you rather have crinkle fries or tater tots? I don't know if I could choose between them. I really don't know if I could choose between crinkle fries or tater tots. Part of me says go with the crinkle fries because, like, they're usually a little bit crispier. Yeah. No. Oh, see, Sam, I could never slather my my uh fries or like tots in anything because i have to dip them because otherwise since i'm such a slow eater they get soggy and gross and then i'm just like Bleh. why um either or as long as it's not mashed potatoes inside yes it has to be fluffy inside that's also a very key point is if it's not fluffy on the inside don't even bother You have to go get the little one. Not a problem, Melanie. Not a problem. Go take care of your little one. Still not eating a plate. No, I dip them, but I don't slather them. Oh, no. It's Miko's birthday. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. The panic sets in. Who let you, the toddler sleep? Who let the toddler sleep? Go here. Teach shapes to Shigo. Come back here. I don't care how tired either of you are. Shigo's skills are nowhere near where they need to be. Oh, dear. She has not passed out. No. She has not passed out. All right. Come on. Come on. Wait, it's already winter again? Oh, it is. Okay, it is almost winter. Oh, it is winter now. Okay, good to know. No, bud. You just need to wait a little bit longer, okay? Thank you. Um, I think of all... I don't think we've had anything new happen since the last, uh, bingo thing. Um, so yeah, no, we haven't had anything new happen. We've just had a lot of repeats. Yeah, we've just had a lot of repeats. I know, bud. I know. Alright, everybody's just tired. Yeah, I think that's what it is. Is Everybody is just tired. Why is there random water droplets here? Alright. Yeah, so she's already... So, Melody's basically done and ready to get kicked out. I'm okay with that, but... Yeah, you need to pee. <laughs> That's a bad thing. Go go pee, please. Thank you. 
Crisp, not burnt outside, and fluffy, but not mashed potato inside. Yes. I actually don't like sweet potato fries. I'm not a big fan of sweet potatoes. Actually, at this, for those that, that know me and have been here long enough, they know it's easier for me to tell you what I will actually eat. Yeah, it, it's easier to tell to, for me to tell you what I will actually eat. So, all right. So, since we are at a really good, uh, we're at a, a kind of a little bit of a pause moment, I do need to do eye drops really quick. So, if you give me a, just what, a couple of sec, couple of minutes, I am going to put some eye drops in my eyes. Because, um, yeah, really need to do that. So, um, yeah, I think, where's my eye thing? There it is. All right. So give me just a, a couple of minutes to get the eye drops in and to dry the the like extra stuff off. So um, while I'm doing this, make sure that you um, stretch, get something to drink, bathroom break or anything like that. And I will be right back.
All right. Did we stretch? Did we get a drink? Did we do anything? Or did we all just sit here? I'm betting majority of people just sat. And, oh, those are super cute pictures. I, we love Saribot. You're eating chips. All right. Fair enough. Fair enough. Fair enough. All right. I need that. Thank you. We're, I think we need food. Do we need food? Now we got plenty of food. Okay. We good. We good. You successfully stayed awake. That's a good thing. That is a good thing. All right. Oh, he's tired. Yeah, he'll be fine. He'll be fine. He'll be fine. It's okay. All you have to do, kid, is do your project. And, yeah. That's about all I need from you is for you to do the project and then I'll let you go do whatever you want. Same like we're letting Melody do whatever she wants because she's done her project and she's done all her homework. Uh, no, Milo, because she needs to sleep. Thank you. You jammed us some music while you sat? Definitely just sat? I mean, hey. It happens. All right. I think. Yeah. So Rufus, you are our main focus at the moment. If I could have you just hurry up and. And finish this. That'd be great. Because hang on. When is the baby? The baby is eating today. So we need to pre-seduce. We, we need to pre-seduce. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, we need to start looking at the next dad. Ha ha ha! That's what I was waiting on. Put it in your inventory, and then I'm sending you to bed, kid. Oof, you in a hot, you a hot mess. I don't know which bed is yours, though. This one is. All right, go sleep. Oh, I have a video going up on the main channel tonight on that Darla. Yes. I have a video, I have a, my video, uh, my reaction on the trailer going up tonight. Sure, you can, you can do that. You can talk to him or whatever. That's fine. All right. I was in for, I was trying to get it up before stream today, but then, um, mom called me this morning at 8 a.m. and said we're going to be there in a half hour, and I was like, well, crap. So, there's just a lot of projects going on around my house at the moment. Yeah, there's, there's just a lot of stuff that we have going on. So, uh, the pack dropped, like, the trailer for it, for me, dropped on, like, the worst day of the week possible. If it had dropped today, that would have been so much better. But, yeah. I will say I'm cautiously optimistic about the gameplay. Very cautiously optimistic. Mm -hmm. Yes, cautiously optimistic is the best way to, to put it. I don't know what she's doing, but okay. Why are my tots always starving? Get up and grab some food before you die. Yeah, just, just get some food. Just get some food. Thank you. Yeah, because once she does that, she literally does need everything. Yeah. All right. I think it's a good idea for us to vote on the next dad. So... All right. These are all old. All right, the next dad, this... And keep in mind, guys, this could potentially be the last dad. So just keep that in mind when you are voting. All right, filter one, filter two. All right.
Uh, I need to take out Encanto because you are not eligible anymore. Okay. All right. So, Oh, uh, let's see. Yep, there we go. We're going to go with this. We're going to go with this. Yes. All right. So go ahead and vote in the poll. If you don't see the poll, you may need to refresh. So your options are we have. Where is it? We have a Prince Philip from Sleeping Beauty. We have. Kristoff from Frozen. We have Oaken from Frozen. We have Fixit Felix Jr. And then we have Yzma. Yzma. So, vote for who you want to be the next dad. Keeping in mind that this might be the final dad. All right. Okay, you got about a minute left to vote on the poll. Remember, we have Yzma. We have Fixit Felix Jr. We have Oaken. Kristoff. And Prince Philip. All right, you got about like 15, 20 seconds left to get your votes in. There's some really good dads on here. I will say there's some really good dads on here. I'm sad we won't be able to use them all because I would love to use them all. All right, and it looks like Kristoff has won. All right. All right, Kristoff has won. Looking at the dads. All right, so just as a reminder, you have two Save the Dads left and one Vlad the Dad left. So just keep that in mind. Keep that in mind. All right, so Kristoff. We will go ahead and add him in because I'm like, we're kind of at a, at a lull for the kiddos, which means it's time to go seducing for the mom after we feed our child. Yeah, after, after, we, after we make sure the child has some food. That's very important. So while you're doing that, open and sneak a present. We're going to abuse the presence glitch. If you don't know what the presence glitch is... The presents never go down. No matter how many times you try to open stuff, it never goes down. Land Coral Garden. I don't know what that is. Is it a picture? I'm guessing it's a picture. Yeah, I'm guessing it's a picture. What did we get? Alright, so it looks like we got two big items. Let's check it out. Oh, I have the toddler thing. I was so confused. Yes, yeah, so the land coral garden is this big painting. All right. Sell that. 7,500 for that? Cool. Cool, cool, cool. I didn't realize it was so expensive when we got it for, for free. Nice. 
Um, I think it works on the small present pile too. It it's been working in the elemental legacy so far. And thank you for that, Sims lover. Thank you for that. Yes. Um, we basically we've yeah, we've been having fun with this. And then, like I said, after this, um, I am going to take two months to focus on our other challenges that we have going on right now. And then we're going to go back to the 100 baby. And it'll be fun. It'll be a lot of fun. All right. Did you eat? That's all I care about is did you eat? You did. All right. Leave the toddler alone. We're going to go and seduce a new dad. Um, and uh, Gabby, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, share, and get comfy. Um, if all your sims open the presents, the pile goes down for you. If you just have one use it, it does not. Interesting. Interesting. Hmm. I wonder why. But, uh, fun fact, guys, if you didn't know this, the presents are not, you don't have to use them just, um, for... Christmas or Winterfest. Um, if you throw a birthday party or a wedding, um, put the present pile down and they can open birthday presents or wedding gifts. Mm -hmm. You're a good boy. He's super antsy. And it's making me giggle. Because he's just like, I don't want to do this. All right, got to make sure we got to move her out. Move her into a new house. Create a new household. Take your money and go, I guess. All right. Now we add him in. Move in. Yes. Very nice. All right. Now we got to go a visit. Yep. Go visiting. Okay. Doke. This will be fun. All right. If it loads. I say if and it stutters. Are you going to load or do I have to do the song? Do I have to do the song? I heard the load music. Are you going to make me do the song? No, you're not. Okay. That, that was smart of you, games. Very smart of you. Mm-hmm. All right. Be buzzed in. Go on up. Where are you going? All right. You're going into the bathroom. So you know what? We're going to try to do this. I'm going to send Cole away, though. I'm going to send Cole away because I don't want to risk. As well as, as Chucky. Alright. Is Cole going to see us? No, they're leaving, leaving. Okay. Are we going to be a three click? Three click? Three click? Three click? <gasps> it's a three click guys it is a three click oh my goodness and hi pop man thank you so much for the follow welcome to the cabana grab a drink grab a lunch turn get comfy i love this all right we need to first kiss first kiss in the bathroom wait did the toddler age up the toddler did age up, so we got to do a quick change. Uh, we'll have to come back in here and change the bed from a to from a kid to a, a toddler to a kid. But I love how she's just smooching him in the bathroom. 
All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Can we woohoo? We can woohoo! We can a woohoo. We're gonna go a woohooing. All right, so O slash if you had three click dad on your. No! Oh god, that was awkward. Uh, Louisa was saved. Yes, Louisa was saved in Eris. Yes. All right. Well, that's the thing that happened. All right. All right. All right. All right. She's go. See, she's going off to go play. Great. You know what? We will go take a shower just because we need to. Yep, we're we're gonna let her take a shower. But we've woohooed him, so he's on the docket. He's on the docket for us to, to get with in a bit. All right. All right. Okay. I think we do need to send her home, though. Um, and Supersonic, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, share, and get comfy. All right. Let's go on in. And welcome on in. How are you? How's your day going? You got a bingo with the three-click dad. All right, guys. Pop it in the Discord. Uh, pop it in the general chat of the Discord, and uh, the mods will verify it and give me a list of people that need to get their points at the end of stream. Um, and Pixel Frog, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, share, and get comfy. I'm doing good. How are you doing? All right. So. I'm very curious how this is going to, how, how this is going to turn out for them. I'm very curious because y'all have been saving a little, y'all have been saving a little bit more than normal. Actually, hang on. When was... How many, let's look really quick while well, this is taking forever and a year to load. Um, in the first set, you saved three and only Vladded one. So you missed out on two Vlads and two saves. In the third, second set, you saved five but didn't Vlad any. Um, in the third set, you saved two Dads and Vladded one. And in this one, you have now saved three dads and Vladded two. That's pretty good odds for you guys. That's pretty good odds. All right, we're going to come open a present. Because we can. And go potty. And of course, there's food right there. Of course. Give me the plate. Give me the plate. Thank you. Thank you. Um, so this dad cannot be Vladded. Um, in order to meet the requirements to be Vladded, um, the past two dads must have survived. So this would have to be dad number three in a row that has survived. So Captain Hook would have been eligible for Vladding if he had not lost his 50-50. Um, but since Louisa is the first one since the last Vlad, um, then Kristoff would not be eligible. Kristoff would have to survive and the dad following would be eligible then. If that makes sense. So, yeah, it's a little complicated. Teach shapes to Shigo. Yeah, come here, come here and teach the shapes to Shigo, please. Soon as she's done poo pooing. Or super efficient baby care first and then and then she go. Yeah, teach shapes to she go. Where are you go? Why are they so obsessed with my plants? I don't know how to feel about this. Yeah, I don't know how to feel about this. No no touchy the toddler. When the toddler's about to be taught things. No touching my toddler. I need you to leave my toddler alone. Thank you. Uh, 
Uh, excuse you, you are not that tired. Go here. Teach shapes to Shigo. Shigo, you are being a pain in the patootie right now. I'm gonna need you to stop. I don't care if you are fussy. I'm gonna need you to stop. Wait, where did mom go? Mom went all the way upstairs. Of course she did. Okay, well... We won't be able to get Shigo up to level 3. Well, like, aged up before school starts. So. Bummer. Alright. No! F's, guys, F's. Truly scrumptious has passed away. It was very sad. Very, very, very sad. Get your rips in chat. Truly scrumptious has passed away. Which means... That we are still waiting on... Shizuka and Pippa are still alive. They have out... Truly did not outlive her older sisters. It's really kind of sad, but you know, it is what it is. So... Uh, teach shapes to Shigo. Ignore that... Sh ignore her. If you have... Why are you just... Melody, I'm gonna need you to stop being a lemon. Go pee. Go pee and then come upstairs and take a shower. Make yourself useful and then go to bed. Oi. Get out of my hair. Leave us alone. Thank you. Super Sonic style. Yes, exactly. Exactly. Um. Yes, so. All right. Wait. You need to pee. And then you can go to sleep. Yes. There we go. Alright. Ooh, thinking level three. Nice, nice, nice. Okay, you can go to bed now. You can go to bed. Sleep. Sleep. I'm letting you sleep because I'm nice. Ish. I mean, let's be real, I'm only nice to the Sims when I want to be, but there you go. Alright, okay, you're doing good, and thank you for reminding me to take a drink. Alright. Aw, Kenzie, you're getting better at not hugging the bots. I'm very proud. I am very proud. Wait, is everybody asleep? One of the rare moments when everyone is asleep. Except for the baby. Go take care of the baby, please. And then go back to sleep. Oh, you're, man, you're almost fully rested. I don't care. We're going to sleep anyway. Cha-cha slides in. Yes. Speaking of cha-cha slides, guys, if you haven't seen the TikTok from the other day, you really should. The Sim totally cha cha over a dead body. And it wasn't even Vlad. Oh, here we go, guys. Here we go. Get your yeets in chat. Yeets in chat. All right. It is, it is, the baby has yeeted. So, 
All right, everybody gather in, gather in, gather in. We're sending all of our vibes and prayers and, and hopes to the to the Sims randomizer. Give me something good. Silly. All right. Do we like silly? If we like silly, then I will lock it in in five, four, three, two, one. Nope, we got Faye coming in. Angelic. All right. If we like angelic, then I will lock it in in five, four, three, two, duck, duck, fussy. If we like fussy, then I will lock it in in five, Darla. Fussy again. If we like fussy, I will lock it in in five, four, Darla again. Fussy again! If we like it, I will lock it in in five, four, three, two, Darla one last time. Silly. That, 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 that took way too long. That. That, that was so, that was so, that, nah, 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 nah. All right, you know what? Go, go slide or something. Yeah, go, go, wait, no, no, don't go slide. I know what we're going to do. We're going to send you to sleep. Yeah. Yep, we're going to do that. So, take a shower really quick and then go eat. It is rebate day. Yeah, we have plenty of time for that. So. Oh, wait, are you up too? Oh, ho, ho, and you need to food desperately. Please eat. Thank you. All right, so everyone's in a good mood-ish for school, so that's pretty good. That That's pretty good. Actually, hang on. How many... Um, Kenzie, when we have the last toddler, um, can we get a, like, a, um... What's it? What's it? A like a a chart. That's what I'm. That's what I'm saying. Oh, and she's gone into labor. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. All right. All right. And school starts in an hour. Wonderful. So can we get like a like a chart of like how many how many trait like how many toddlers we had with each of the traits just to see? Cause I'm curious. I'm I'm curious. But at the like at the end. Yeah, at the end. So, all right, we we need to send the kiddos to school though. So we're gonna wait to send them. She goes very hungry. Of course she goes. She goes all way. Oh my God, she go is starving. Please eat, she go. I can't. I can't do anything until you eat. No, no talkie to mom. Both of you go to school. Thank you. No watch. No watch. You can you can do that when you come when you're when you're done. Sit. I need you to come sit. Something happened. Something happened. Oh, Melody's responsible. Good. 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 All right. Um, Shigo, please eat. Please eat. Please eat. Thank you. 
you're hoping for independent independent is good um however the best trait for toddlers is actually not independent it's inquisitive so if you have inquisitive for a toddler that's amazing for you all right and she's gonna pee herself go potty nope that's not gonna work all right well you weren't supposed to be eating the popcorn because you're about to give birth two hours and we're fine finish your popcorn Finish your popcorn. Okay, you're taking too long on the popcorn. Yeah, you're taking way too long on the popcorn. Put that down. You're going to the hospital. Yeah, we're going to the hospital. Yeah, nope, nope, we're not doing that. Alright, guys, go ahead and gamble if you think it's going to be a boy or a girl. All right. Ariana, what are you doing? Oh my gosh. I look away for half a second and go to the freaking hospital. I know you're pre mm. uh, Why are you not going to the hospital? Go to the hospital. You know what? We're just going to bring Cole with us. Why not? She's glitched. I swear, if I don't get a birth certificate out of this, I'm going to be mad. It's that stupid popcorn machine. She's about to give birth, but the problem is it's not sending her to the hospital. So I don't know what happened and what went wrong. So I'm saving and going and managing worlds and going back in and trying to immediately send her to the hospital. Actually, hold on. If I send her to go visit somewhere... She can't give birth if she's visiting somewhere. Yeah, so let's have her visit here. All right, so we're going to try this. If this doesn't work, I don't know what we're going to do. All right, have baby at hospital. Join. Why did that work? Or it better have worked. It better not have sent us home. Come on, please, 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 please have worked. Please have worked. Thank you. All right. She's literally like, it's, it's like seconds from happening. All right. There we go. All right. So 68% said boy, 32% said girl. I'm going to follow the trend and I'm going to say girl. All right. She's an adult. Okay. I wasn't sure by the hair color because the hair color is like the grayish. So I wasn't sure if she was an elder yet or not. So our goal is to have our last kid before she becomes an elder or a ghost. All right, let's see. Okay, girl. I'm going to go girl. Oh, 
All right. And it is a... Oh, it's a boy. Hi, Jesse. How are you? All right. Y'all win with the boy. So let me adjust this. All right, so go ahead and give me the names that you want for the baby. Remember, it needs to be the character and the universe. It cannot be from Lion King, Atlantis, Phineas and Ferb, Frozen, Little Mermaid, or um, Kim Possible. So it is now open for you. Go ahead and give me the names. You're good just doing a ton of laundry. Nice, nice. I need to do laundry. Yes, I need to do laundry. All right, we got room for one more. One more, guys. Give me one more name. Yep, give me one more name and I'll get this poll started. Ooh, I like that. You guys are coming in with great names. All right. All right, let me throw this in. All right. And there you go. The poll has started. And Easton, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, and get comfy. All right, go ahead and vote for the names. All right. I'm interested to see what you guys choose. Mm-hmm. Yep. Also, Jesse, I have to say your Steam name is hilarious. I've, I've, I have died laughing each time I've seen your your Steam name. Ten out of ten. Uh huh. Yeah. It is amazing. I, I don't want to know the story behind it. I just, I, that's what I thought it was. It was hilarious to see, like, pop up on my, pop up in the corner of my screen that you're playing DVD and that pops up. And I was just like, <laughs> it was great. It was great. All right, guys, you got like 45 seconds to get your name votes in. So go ahead and vote and we'll see. All right, you got 30 seconds left. Make sure you are getting your votes in. All right, and the winner is... Come on, Twitch. Grumpy. All right, Grumpy. Which uh funny story about that about the word Grumpy. Um my grandma used to make a uh Polish dish called Gwumki. Um and it's one of my favorite all-time favorite dishes. Basically, it's like stuffed cabbage. Um but my mom will make it now and when my stepdad first like when we first introduced it to him, um he couldn't pronounce the word uh, Gwumki. Uh, so he just called it Grumpy. So anytime we'd have it, he'd be like, are we having Grumpy tonight? And it, it, even though now he knows what, what the term, like what the term for the dish is, um, he still calls it on occasion Grumpy. And it just, anytime I see the name, like the word Grumpy now, it makes me laugh because it makes me think of that. Yeah, really fun. Which if you have not had Gwumki, I highly recommend it. All right. Oh, I need to. We need to do the 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 thing on if it's twins or not. 
All right, gamble really quick. This is a quick one. You got a minute a minute to do it. Oh, you did a no mither only challenge. Oh, man, I'm mad I missed that. I need to go and watch that. I need to go and watch that. I need to do the, um, yeah, there's one. Is it no mither or no, there's the, in the tome, it's the dead heart. I need to do a dead heart only. I'm not looking forward to that because I, I cannot use that perk at all. Hi, double seven. Visit cat news and strolls casually in chat. Thank you for that. You're loving the fact that I can't yell at you today, aren't you? That one's easy. I, you need a, you need a nice killer for that. All right, and, okay, it is closed. Let's find out in three, two, one. Single birth. All right. So, that means, where is my thing? And there's that. We are up to 97. 97, guys. That is true, Jesse. That is true. That is true. That is definitely true. Oh, no. Evelyn, did you gamble all of them on that? Oh, no. Oh, no. Uh, don't worry, though. You do earn them back. You do earn points rather quickly. You do earn points rather quickly. Hi, Jesse from TikTok. Um, yeah, so we'll, so it definitely, um, this does make it to where Kristoff would have to wrap this, it up with triplets. It is possible. It is possible, but kind of, uh, kind of unlikely. We'll see though. We'll see. All right. I am going to be mean and I am going to wrap it up right here. So, I did up the baby counter. I did up the baby counter. But I am, with that, I am going to be a little bit evil. Because I don't get to troll y'all that often. Y'all usually troll me. I don't get to troll y'all. So, I'm going to do my best to troll you guys and end it right before we go and get preggy. So, yeah. Um, but thank you for hanging out with me today, guys. Uh, thank you for all the bits and such today. Um, for all the follows. You guys have been absolutely amazing. Um, and all of you guys just for hanging out with us today. So. Um. There's a good chance we're not gonna do shell tours on Monday. I'll let you guys know in the Discord. Um, yes, so the bingo. Um, mods, can you confirm... Did we have, how many bingos did we have confirmed? I know we had, um, okay, we have two. So we have K Vogel and we have a Duck Duck. I will give you guys your points after stream uh, today, um, just so that way I can copy and paste. Um, but, all right, well, thank you for hanging out with us today. Thank you, thank you. Um, you know what? I haven't, we haven't had it over, we haven't had it have not headed over to see Sarah in a while. So, yeah, everybody pile on in. We're going to go say hi to Sarah Kendall today. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we're going we're gonna to go say hi to her. So, um, but thank you for hanging out with me today. I will let you guys know in the Discord. If you are not in the Discord, there is the Discord link as well as all of the socials as to what the schedule for next week is going to be. It's still up in the air as to, like, how I'm going to do shell tours. So, um, yeah, anyway... I think that's about all that I have for you guys today. Oh, I had something. I did have something for you. Now I can't think of it. I don't know. We'll, we'll figure it out. I'll figure it out and I'll post it in the Discord. So keep an eye on that. Oh, I know what it was. A YouTube video going up on the main YouTube channel tonight. So keep an eye out for that. Uh, keep an eye in the uh, Discord. Uh, you'll get a notification for that. And yeah. So, all right. Grab your rain messages, guys. Pile on in. We're going to go say hi to Sarah. Uh, if you have not met Sarah before, you will love her. Uh, she is really, really fun. Always fun to go over there. So, 
Where'd my thing go? All right. Yes. But uh, what were all the daubs? Uh, good question. Um, scrolling back up to see what Wyatt last put in chat. Uh, here, I'll just recopy that. There you go. There, those were all the daubs. Those were all the daubs. Um, unless there were more since I last did that. Oh, Wyatt did it. Thank you, Wyatt. All right, so go ahead. Pile on in, guys. We're going to go and raid over to Sarah. I love you all. Thank you for hanging out with us. Thank you for a wonderful week. Um, you guys have already started June off absolutely wild. So thank you for that. Um, and I will see you guys all back here on Monday. If I don't see you Monday, I'll see you sometime next week. Have a wonderful weekend. Be safe. Uh, stay cool. Um, and yeah, just, just have fun this weekend, guys. Have fun. And yeah, if you do anything fun, post pictures in the Discord. So, all right. I love you guys. Let's go say hi to Sarah. And I'll see you guys all later. Okay? Love you guys. Bye!